天と地が一つに見えるとここは本当のあの世ビヨンドかもしれん。ジョナさん、久しぶり。二十八年ぶり。しかし、ジョナさんイングラム。久しぶり。ジョナさん。ジョナさんイングラムか。懐かしいな。Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you're all doing well on this fine Friday. I have one question for you. Are you ready to go on a Kojima mind bend? Certainly hope you are, because I am. It's part four, I think, of the police, police notes. A game that we didn't get over here in the West. But some nice people have translated it into English for us. Isn't that nice? I genuinely forgot where we left off with this. It's been a while since I played this, but I have been excited in getting back to it. Evening, everybody. Like I say, hope you all you hope you're all having a fine, fine Friday. Whoa! Ah. <laughs> Thank you. Who threw that? Firing my log. Hi, Mal. How's it going? All right. Let's get on with it. Let's continue from. Ah. Let, let's continue from where we left off. Act three. I know I've got to put in disc three in a minute. There we go. Hey, go ferret. Merry weekend. Or I mean Duke. <laughs> hey, go ferret. How's it going? Welcome on in. I forgot how good Borderlands 2 was last night. Yeah, Borderlands 2 is a fun time. Fun time indeed. I've not played Borderlands 3, but I was a big fan of Borderlands 1 when it came out. Played 1, 2. Never got around to the pre-sequel or whatever that was called. And Borderlands 3... Uh, by that time, the, the friend group have kind of moved on to different things. 
All right, load CD image, that one. Got to do this a little bit roundabout way because the emulator does not like it if I just go straight onto the disk. I have to load disk one and then load the save. All right, progress loaded. View the summary screen, yes please. Act three, drug. Jonathan searches for Kenzo Hojo at the request of his ex-wife, Lorraine. It seems his work with K9 got him involved in something much, much bigger. Having learned the truth behind K9 from Ishida, Jonathan and Ed encounter the biker again. They get into a car chase followed by a shootout on the linear rail. Is Redwood the biker? What happened to Dave's body? Jonathan and Ed have new mysteries to solve. Alone. <laughs> Just drug. <laughs> the chapter names have been kind of hilarious. Well, we can always do more Borderlands in between the 500 dragon things you do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that is true. I have some new games lined up for this week as well. That should be fun. I came to the end of Yakuza 0. We finally finished Yakuza 0. I couldn't believe it, but wow, what an ending that was to that game. Absolutely fantastic, though I'm not quite yet to jump into more Yakuza. It's going to be something different this week. It's going to be one of my favorite shooters that I've not had a re-go of in a while. So I figured, well, let's give that a go. I'm in the mood to play it. Kiryu-chan! Yeah. <laughs> that ending, wow, just when Majima and Kiryu met and it was very clear that Majima had maybe kind of snapped somewhere and he looks as if he's maybe completely lost his mind. I don't know, but Yakuza 1 is going to be a fun ride, but that's not going to be for a while. We've got a visual novel to play, so let's get on with it. Ah, uh, yeah. Dave's Dave's dead. Got shot at the end of the last chapter. Oh, the last chapter was so action-packed. It was really cool. So, we're in his office. Let's have a bit of a look around. I forgot what I looked at. What's that? This graffiti that Dave carved, it feels like he's still here. It's a lavender bouquet. I guess we'll need... We'll need to get someone else in now. Everybody's dead, Dave. Everybody is dead. Everybody is dead, Dave. They're not going to send anyone else. We could be the end of Vice. Dave's chair. It's strange. Yesterday he was sitting there chomping through his hamburgers and now he's gone. It used to be Dave's chair. We double tap everything. Because there's, there's dialogue all, all over the place. This is a visual novel, so we're going to be doing a lot of reading. Or well, I'm going to be doing a lot of reading and reading it out for you, fine folks. What's this envelope? That's a Japanese prize envelope from something Dave won at a hobby show. The one that video game company holds every year. Uh, oh yeah, the Hyper Award. The Konami Video Game Awards for Excellence. I bet that last a long time. What? You want it? It's empty. Oh, Dave's model dinosaur. Things like that are all I've got left of him now. Him and his stupid toys, huh? Dave was really into sci-fi monsters. The kind that can go around and do whatever they want. Don't lead to the boiler room. You get the occasional problem in there, so APs will come down and check it out. Bastards usually wake me up. So that's the boiler room through there. Dave used to go in there and mess around with the equipment. Oh, did he? Oh, there's the bag. You've got that here? Like I said, it doesn't suit me. That doesn't matter. Dave gave it to me. I nearly had a heart attack when I saw it. It's the Ellis bag Dave gave Meryl. Yeah, this is Meryl, by the way. If you are familiar with Metal Gear Solid, you might recognize the character sat at the desk here. Oh, Final Fantasy XIV is a titan of a game. Sure sounds like it. Nothing important in the boiler room. Well, aside from the boiler, obviously. Uh, Alright. Okay, Meryl, how are you holding up? You look exhausted. Did you get any sleep? I'm okay, thanks. I don't think I could sleep anyway. 
whatever woman I have in me is staying buried till I get back at them for Dave. Meryl, she looks lonely. She'll be fine. She's a strong woman. And now I'm playing more Langris or two. I saw you playing that and then I looked up. You sent me some screenshots, obviously. Thank you very much for the showing me the dragons in it. I looked that up. Looked quite interesting. A game never released outside of Japan, right? So I'm guessing you have an English translation of it somewhere. But it did look really cool. Again, just cool Mega Drive games we never bloody got. You want NBA 94, don't you? You don't want anything interesting, but us Brits really don't go for basketball anyway. How are things going, Meryl? Any developments? Yeah, a couple of things, actually. All right. Not good at small talk. The past doesn't matter as much as how you live here and now, don't you think? Oh, well, the first game out came out for Mega Drive. It was oh, it had a name change. It changed to Warsong. Huh. Okay. The Wikipedia article on Langrisser was not very informative. Assuming I looked at the right page, so it was changed to Warsong. I might have to look that up. Assuming it was even sold in Europe, I don't even know. I'll keep looking for Dave. I can't believe this has happened. AP recovered Ishida's body, but Tokugawa are demanding it be turned ah, over to them. And that reminds me. Uh, I hopefully have fi the sh fixed the shiny thrower for when bits are donated. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. I might have looked over my settings and gone, oh, that number's probably not supposed to be there, so I moved it around a bit. Sure hope it works. Fishing for bits? Nah, never. Me? me? Moi? Never. He's probably dead, but I'll check every hospital to see if he was taken anywhere. Hey, Cat Wolf, how's it going? Speaking of stuff that should be fixed, let me check. Uh, the monch is back, although fish, I'm not sure. Fish is a weird one, it doesn't monch. Frozeners have to contact the government whenever they're hospitalized. There'd be a record of it. Tokugawa employees are crawling all over AMM. AP stretches the... Ah! Yeah, it does work. Excellent. I'm so relieved. <laughs> I had to... I was going backwards and forwards through the settings like, why isn't this working? Oh, right, yeah. That number's probably not supposed to be there. <laughs> but thank you for the check. How am I? I am good, thank you. I've had an absolutely sparkling day. I went to the gym. I did a lovely walk down from my house. It was nice and sunny. I walked from my house to the gym, 20 minute walk. Lovely sunshine and all the flowers are out and everybody is out having a chat and the shops are open. It was a really, really nice atmosphere walking to the gym. And I might have actually overdone it on the gym. My legs really hurt. <laughs> I might have overdone it just a little bit, but I had a good session on the bikes. And then I love swimming. I love swimming at the gym so I spent about 45 minutes in the pool doing laps that was pretty nice and then I had a nice Thai tea with family and come back to play some police knots it has been a pretty good day thank you how are you doing though Catawolf how are you doing how's everybody doing I hope everybody's doing well like I always say hope everybody's doing well uh, show Hoja's photo Get the feeling we may never find out what happened to him. Oh yeah, Hojo is, well, maybe, maybe dead. Maybe not, I don't know. He checked into a building, but didn't check out. Now imagine me doing dragon doggy paddles in the swimming pool. It could be like that. Everybody gets out of the pool though. I don't know why. I jump in the pool and everyone just goes, oh God, and they get out and I'm like, why? What, what did I do? I'm just a dragon one in a swim, jeez. I have shorts on, if that bothers anybody. Yeah, 
I'm dead. <laughs> and that was the day I died of a million bruises. That, uh, the, the, ah, several of them were very pointy. Yeah. Wolf of Air, 5,000 bits. Holy crap. Thank you. Jeez. <laughs> yeah, that was a big check, wasn't it? <laughs> if everybody's done trying to knock me unconscious. But holy chisel, thank you for the 5,000 bits. My God. Absolute mad lad. Knock him off stream. <laughs> Hydrate. All right, okay. Fair enough. Mmm. <clears throat> what have I got? I've got a touch of mango passion fruit. Lovely. You were saving it for this moment, uh huh. <coughs> oh, blimey. You should keep that ID card to yourselves. You'd be even more trouble if Tokugawa found out about it. Ah, <coughs> I'll give you some dancing dinos for that wolf and bat. Thank you. There you go. Dancing dinos, just for you. Kitty. What else can I share? Walk away? Is that all I can do here? Ask about... Oh. Was Redwood? Redwood wasn't an option, was it? Oh, no. Redwood was... Oh, my God. Yeah, I put, like, 18 bullets into Redwood, and he didn't... Didn't even feel it because he's a frozen and they don't feel that kind of stuff. Uh, walk away, I guess. Same, I didn't actually throw one throw for one bit. Eh, 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 eh. No. Actually, gonna go make a sandwich now. Fair enough. Yeah, Lucas, if you need to like de stream, go get some water, stretch your legs, you know, whatever. Yeah, you, you do that. Oh, you clipped that, did you, Mel? <laughs> Thank you. Uh, uh, the, um, so, um, yeah, that was, that was dragon abuse. I can't do anything else. I think I have to walk away, I guess. Just going to walk away. Oh, what do you think of my idea? I don't know. Did you tell me your idea? I got distracted by being slapped in the face with Chinese. Wasn't anything written on there that looked useful. Sorry, Mel, I forgot what you said. What what did you tell me to do? Any the new leads, Meryl? Yeah, a couple of things actually. Alright, tell me. Took a go away plays a crawling over AMM. If you search to the limit with everything that happened. Maybe I should go back to the AMM then. showed everything to you. <sighs> I guess we're out of here then. Um... Oh, we can maybe... Actually, yeah, let's chat to people. Let's go check, chat with... Um... What's his name? Vincent? His name was Vincent? Victor, sorry. Hey, what's going on? Hi, Gorby. Looking for the analysis result of the blood. I'm still working on it. Oh, yes, I gave you that white blood sample, didn't I? Still working it. Okay. Hey, Gorby. How's life, Gorby? He's processing something right now, actually. Cool. Well, you keep at it, Gorby. room. Thanks for your time, Victor. Oh yeah, I got chewed out by Gates, didn't I? But the AP. <sighs> I've already spoken to you, Gates. Gates not happy with our last little rampage through the city. <laughs> Bobby, I guess. Oh. If I try and leave, he'll tell me what my next move is. Edo. 
DDS の奥に工場があったろそこにあると思うかなければお前の首はなくなる俺も地球へ送還されるおいおい<笑>大丈夫だ必ずあるガードマンが言ってたろサンプルは試作工場で作るってブツを握ればゲイツも腰を上げずにはおられないそれはそうだな That's true <sighs> Ready to head out yeah, These guys are called Emps I think EMPS That's the Goddard Emps It's used for most of the work around here We might have caught him if we'd had one of those Jesus I think if you'd been flying one of these things it would have made him would have been a million times worse BCP sign let's get in the car to Tokugawa uh, Tokugawa pharmaceuticals we go Yes, Tokugawa Seiyaku へ向かおう念のため寄り道をしていこうつけられてるかもしれん分かった。本部長なら見張りをつけてるかもしれん。一回りしてから行こう。Good idea. <音声>徳川製薬だぞ。この中のどこかにナークカプセルがあるはずだ。一セットでも発見できれば。それで奴らの犯罪を立証できるその代わり何も出なかった時は諦めるんだぞ必ずあるさこの中にさあ矢探しだ Doing a little bit of breaking in Right It's a lamppost Carefully it isn't connected to an alarm I doubt it Maybe Open the door with the ID card. Front da. Dare mo inai na. Saisho no mono mono shi keikai kara suru to uso no yo da. Do kara hajimeru. Do kangae temo ano oku no heya ga ayashii na. Asoko o shirabe yo. Seems logical. <laughs> As Buck would say. Look at this map. It shows a couple of large areas straight ahead. Everything points to that back door. There are no other ways back there? Doesn't seem like it. Meaning we have to get it open somehow. I don't think my ID card is going to work, is it? This booth must give you access to the building's security system. That we could get it going though. Maybe I should check in the DDS office first. ID card を使うぞ。まだ抹消されてなければいいがな。ここにはもう何もないかもしれんな。よし、ロックシステムに ID を差し込んでみよう。ID を差し込んで。DDS ルームだこの部屋にはナークはなさそうだがそのようだなナークを隠すには小さすぎる部屋だ You never know Go through through few drawers Go through through boxes You never know Well my guy promoted from a dragon knight to dragon lord Ooh. and he has a lightning breath attack nice good stuff is that in final fantasy 14 or oh no langrisser langrisser right all evidence directly related to hojo is gone now yeah there was something scribbled on that board but somebody got rid of it don't know who though Display of the case here's projects Hojo was worked on. 
Okay, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Contact lens drug K9 was supposed to go here, but he never got the chance. Anything behind the screen? Oh, don't go picking up the receiver. Might be a sensor in it. Okay. It's a partition that was used before. Can I move that? Ah. Thank you. Separated by separated the DDS teams from one another. Okay, fine. Maybe there isn't anything in here. I just wanted to look around. Really broke the bank with this place. They look more or less like the machines you'd find in a place like this. Doesn't seem like they're doing anything with Nark in here, does it? Just an ordinary lab. That's what they want you to think. Maybe there isn't anything in here. Fine, I'll leave. Okay, let's try the back door. It's a magnetic lock system for this door. This is advanced stuff. Way more advanced than the DDS room lock. Oops. Won't open if the lock hasn't been released. Okay. It's just something about this door, don't you think? Yeah, I know. How are we gonna get it open? You need an M's to get through this. Guess we'll have to try something with the lock system and hope for the best. According to the map, this is the biggest area of the facility. Yeah, it's gotta be back here. It must be this thing, right? It's behind that door there, it's gotta be. That must be the place. Are there no other ways back there? Doesn't seem like it. We gotta get it open somehow. Yosh, lock system ni ID o sashikonde mio. ID o sashikonde. Oh, Jonathan, tobira ga ita do. Shikashi, kore dake no security ga ID dake de akuto wa mio da na. KB no hanashi da to. ここは徳川本人の許可が下りないと開けられないとか言ってたろ。エド、気にしすぎだ。さあ、行こう。おお、ボーイ、what oh Oh boy. Black puppies. Dangerous drugs. Quick, somebody get their phone camera out. Masashiku,ナークの原料となるブラックポピーだよ。この身から取れる乳液でナークが作られる。これがクロケシ。それにこの葉、ロレインが持ってきたあの旗と同じだ。遺伝子操作と品種改良をされた新種のクロケシだ。こんなクロケシは見たことがない。There's no soil here, is there? They're cultivating them hydroponically, meaning they can grow them in just a nutrient solution. They don't need any soil at all. What's more. Tokugawa led the field when it comes to hydroponics. They're not using xenon grow lights. Looks like they're using optical fiber to transfer sunlight here. They must use a mirror to gather sunlight at night too. They can even control the amount of light by chaos system. So this place gets constant sunlight, better than any tropical paradise. The word cesspool comes to mind. Hey Bryce! Hey Kirby man! This is really exciting music for a flower field. Oh it absolutely is! 10 out of 10, we'll never hear a more exciting music track for a field again. Maybe. There's another room at the back. Looks like some kind of factory. That's a funny looking door. 
It's an automatic door built with intelligent materials. If the room temperature exceeds a specific degree, a group of shaped memory alloy springs pop up and the door opens. Basically, the door opens to cool the room if it gets too hot. Lucky for us, the place is like a goddamn sauna right now. You can see the room in the back from here. So, well, I'm going to guess it's going to be locked then. Can I take a free sample? Let's grab some for evidence. Wait! They're connected to laser sensors. See them sticking out the field? Touch anything and an alarm will go off. Son of a bitch. Look, but not touch. There's nothing else we can do right now. Let's keep looking around. That was Hideo Kojima's point and click policeman. It's going well so far. We're on disc three. And we're gathering evidence against uh, against this whole this whole conspiracy. Okay, I guess the back door then. There's a walkway going around the poppy field. This also leads to the area at the back. There's no need to rush things. Let's make sure we've checked out this place thoroughly first. Okay. More fields up there too. This looks similar to an auditorium. They've got this set up in three levels. It's designed so each level gets the optimum amount of sunlight. Let's take a look elsewhere. Let's check out around here a little more to make sure we haven't missed anything. Hmm. Is this place automated? It looks like everything's controlled by chaos system. Humidity, temperature, sunlight. It's all running totally by itself. It could minimize the number of people in the know and prevent human error. Look, they've even increased the carbon dioxide in the air to accelerate their growth. You could do multiple harvests a year under these conditions. Chaos. Where's Shadow when you need him? ロレインから預かった葉の消しの葉はここで作られたものだ。王女はここから持ってきたんだ。全くビヨンド内で堂々と黒消し栽培とはいい根性だ。消しの栽培だけでもかなりの重罪だ。消し栽培だけであとは害
That's what's so unique about Nark, and also the scariest part about it. Here they combine the heroin with the hallucinogen to make Nark. Oh. I've already seen how they synthesize Nark from the opium. Let's look at other stages. Before they do that, though, comes this. Here yeah, they're extracting the sap from the pods. It has certain alkaloids used for making drugs like morphine and codeine. Then, by drying the sap, you get opium. You can then isolate morphine from the opium. You still remember all that from narcotics? I got an award there, remember? So did you. What are they doing so far is the same process you go through to produce normal opium derivatives. So that's how narc is made. Oh, I guess it's a drug too. Absolutely, yeah. Narc, narc is bad. Extracting the sap from the pods here. It used to make morphine. It's funny, I'm listening to a sound in the background. I swear I've heard that in another game. One of my secret superpowers is to be able to tell, tell when sounds in video games are shared between one another. I'm pretty sure that background sound is something in System Shock 2. <laughs> What's this? We've already seen how they extract the opium from the poppies. Let's look at the other stages. Well, let's have a look at the big obvious one. What is this? Are these tablets? Are these the capsules? ベルトコンベアで流されていく倉庫で運ぶされるんだろう。ナーキャプソル、K9。We finally found it. Oh boy. Here they're chemically separating Nark into two. They get two capsule types as a result. Everything on Hojo's CD was the truth. The separate capsules offer no narcotic reaction on their own. That's the trick. After they separate Nark, they go on to the next step. Here they're placing the separated Nark liquids in gelatin and turning them into capsules. And that's how they get their Nark capsules. And for the final step, the marks that identify the different capsules, the drug identification codes, get printed on. If this counter is right, they're pumping out several hundred pairs of capsules a second. This step completes the process. There's water here? さっきの決済場所で採れた消しの実がどんどん流れてくる。何もかもが自動化されてる。まさにナーク製造工場だ。黒消しの栽培からナーク それからAPとここに踏み込むってのはどうだ本部長もこれを見れば目を覚ますだろう。いくつかいただいていこう。どうするつもりだ。ゲイツへの手土産だ。行こう。というわけだ、ゲイツ。それがそのナーク<笑> いいのか奴らをこのまま登らしにしても間違いないだろうな間違いありません
よしわかった徳川も年貢の納め時だろうご苦労だったな二人と一緒に来るかもちろんジョナサン君の半導銃リコイルを返しておこう特例だぞいいな分かってる特別扱いは嫌いじゃないよし鉛筆部隊 AP 全員第二次装備で集合徳川製薬へ踏み込む死ぬどころかピンピンしてるぞ。飲んでこうと。行くぞ、やろう。制約についたぞゲイツここがナークを密造している工場だエドヨナさん案内してくれ We're gonna nail these bastards to the wall Damn if only in the future we mastered taking images instead of being awesome I know right not a single cell phone camera anyway you th you'd think as police for real they would like be taking photographic evidence Why do I have a horrible feeling that this is probably going to backfire? It, it, this can't be as straightforward as it lets on. This is the entrance to the building. I know you, Kojima, you've always, you've always got another plan up your sleeve. That factory's right through there. Tokugawa Pharmaceuticals NARC production facility. Hmm? What's up, Bryce? It's only a lamppost. That lamppost, there's a conspiracy theory behind that lamppost. I bet there is. In we go. Gates. Norikomose. Yosh. Epi Tai Ijinsuke! Epi Tai Ijinsuke! Epi Tai Ijinsuke! Never twist in the third act. Never. Never. Oh, 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 プロケシ栽培ナーク密造の容疑だ何のことだい一体捜査令状はあるジョナサンどこだ案内してくれ Oh I sure will This guy is one of the security guards here Another oriental chap I see Let's try talking to him Listen you Now we want the truth What do you guys think you're doing? You've got an arc stashed away back there, don't you? Yeah, we know all about what's going on. Don't bother trying to bullshit us. Are you guys crazy? Slaps a find on the size of Francis Union onto me for spreading dangerous conspiracy theories. I'm not spreading dangerous conspiracy theories. Oh my God, I have the funniest. You've just reminded me of something really funny. I'm gonna wait until the music's died down and we get past this action bit, but I have a quite funny story that happened to me today, actually. <laughs> Regarding conspiracy theories, it's true. Hey, Eredren, how goes it with the utmost importance? The fuzz will save the day. <laughs> What's that factory in the back for? What are you doing there? It's a factory for producing drug samples. 
You mean the for producing narc? What are you talking about? You can't just throw around accusations like that. Let me in. Can you open it? No, I think you can only open it from the security booth right now. Oh. Hmm. We'd like to take a look at the factory in the back. You can't do that. You need President Tokugawa's authorization before I could let you in there. Open that door this instant. I can't. Not by myself, anyway. What do you mean, not by yourself? We were able to open it just fine. Open that door now. That lock system is different from the others. I can't make the decision to open it myself. If you don't open that door, I'll have you arrested for obstructing a police investigation. You'll have to ask President Tokugawa. I can't do it on my own. Hmm. I said open that bloody door. You're gonna wish you hadn't done this. Have you forgotten who you're dealing with? Open that door. Look, there are two large areas back there. That's it. That's what they're... That's where they're doing it. Seems plausible, yes. Don't go try to hide anything. Got it? You afraid of Sadoki? I promise you we can protect you. Protect me? What can you guys do? You're nothing. What do you have to gain by standing up for Tokugawa like this? I... I don't know what you're talking about. Ah, he's starting to crack. He's starting to lose it. Good cop, bad cop time. I've got nothing to say to you. Oh, he's pants sweating now. わかった、徳川の犬め。少し手洗いが遠慮を使おう。小田戸英範、この扉を定調に破壊しろ。了解。待て。誰だ。と、徳川会長。ふん。佐田沖。いいところに来たな。まったく様たちか。ここで何をし
fields they've got up top are the same size as this one here. It's a three level structure. Sunlight reaches every one of the levels. ジョナソン、どうした。これは我が社の極秘プロジェクトの地球環境対策として開発された人工波だ。炭酸ガスを普通の3倍も吸収するという画期的なものだ。エコロジーテロリストなどに知られると厄介なんで極秘にしてたん
バカを言うなこれは無重力化でも均等に妖怪するというカプセル系ないんだ<笑>もう少しまともな言い訳をするんだなこのカプセルの秘密は分かってる秘密だとジョナサン見ろ違うぞこれはナックカプセルじゃない目印がないすり替わってる何<笑>やりやがったなサダオキシそれくらいにしておいたらどうだこれ以上は冗談では済まされんぞそれともまだ続けるかジョナサンエド確かにここなんだな確かだここに間違いないゲイツ捜査は済んだろうさあこの失態をどうしてくれる待て徳川まだだまだ済んでないおい AP 隊お前たちこの中をくまなく調べろ隅から隅までな了解各班参加して工場内を捜査しろエンプさんは各種センサーを使用しろおいおい会社の設備を壊さんでくれよそう出ましたどうした何か出たか来てくださいこっちです出たぞエド行こう<笑>男の死体です北条どうしてここに北条がガイシャは北条健三ここの社員です急いで犯人の足跡指紋 DNA 指紋を採取了解エンプスの簡易アナライザーを使いますどういうことなんだ隊長死体に生活反応が見られます殺害現場はこことみて間違いないでしょう遺体の体温 34.3 度ここの室温が高温ということを考慮しても死後4時間以上は経っていないと思われますレッドウッドここのビデオカメラに何か映ってるかもしれん調べてみろどうぞセキュリティ室へ案内しましょう扉やドアノブに付着していた指紋はルテニウム法による指紋検出により一致しましたよし DNA 指紋の方はどうだ北条に付着していた毛髪および工場内に残されていた毛髪数本から DNA 指紋を検出ポリモルフィズム法により一致よし狂気は狂気はビヨンドでは珍しいリコイルです弾痕検査をすれば立証できます薬きもあります BCP の記録にあるライフリングとの称号を急げゲイツこいつは何を言ってるありましたビデオカメラにも映ってましたやはり殺害時刻は4時間前よしそれでいいここの警備員斎藤の証言も取れましたガイシャとイングラムは今朝未明工場で言い争っていたそうですうん素晴らしいパーフェクトだゲイツ、なんだ何をしているよろしい、ご苦労。事件は解決した。本部長、どういうことですジョナサン・イングラム、君を北条健三並びに石田純、北条ロレイン殺害容疑で逮捕する。逮捕俺をかエド、君にも話を聞かねばならんな。ことによれば君も処分しなければなるまい貴様はめたなやめろジョナサン正体を表したかジョナサン・イングラムお前は4時間前ここで北条と言い争った前妻であるロレインへの嫉妬心からその銃で北条を射殺した今のようにそうやってなゲイス銃を返したのもそういうことだったのか同じようにロレインをホームで殺害お前があの方の爆弾について精通していることはカバン屋での記録を見ればわかる爆弾を解体したのはお前だからなあれは裏付けも取れているロス死刑から連絡があった貴様の事務所から爆破用の起爆装置が見つかったとな起爆装置あの犯行に使われたバイクも貴様は途中へ行った。
Puzzle, thanks for the resubscribe. How you doing? We're in trouble. ジョナサン、このビヨンド内でそんな反動の大きい火薬銃を持っているものはいない。しかもライフリングの残る足のつく銃はな、見てみるがいい。APもBCPもレンチもみんな無反動銃、リフトガンだ。わからんか。宝城
しめるつもりですかあの頃のまま俺にとってはつい昨日のことなんだ Jonas. 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 俺は一体…今何時だあれ時計がないああ腕時計ねあれ電磁手錠に干渉したらしくて止まってたわそうか壊れたかでどうして俺はここにそうだ俺は奴らにはめられて逮捕されたんだそうよ BCP からホームの警察に送還されるところだったのそれがどうしてエドと BBC のスタッフと協力して脱獄させたのあなたを取材中にテレビ中継者と護送者が拘束で事故ったことになってるの脱獄、What? Wow. 今あなたはビヨンドの有名人よテレビではあなたのことで持ちきり30年間のジェラシーってね指名手配されてるわどうして俺をテレビ局が徳川の不正や悪行にはみんな嫌気がさしているのよ私たちの番組では徳川の不正を何年も追ってきたの今回の事件は徳川の尻尾をつかむいい機会だわスタッフが何人か入院しちゃってツケは大きかったけどよかった BBC はまだ奴らの支柱にはないんだなそう報道はあなたの味方よいしょっと大丈夫ジョナサンエドから連絡あるまでゆっくりして。Oh boy, I can't wait to check out BBC News and see what's going on. Actually, let's check that out right now. Can I? Oh, I don't know if you want to sit down for this. Uh oh. Konnichiwa. ニュースオーダーの時間です繰り返します本日未明連続殺人の容疑でホームへ強制送還されることになっていたジョナサン・イングラム容疑者を乗せた護送車が宇宙港へ向かう途中 BBC のテレビ中継者との接触事故により爆発炎上乗っていたイングラム容疑者は現在もなお逃走中指名手配されておりますこの事故で BCP BBC 局員数名が軽傷を負い宇宙航線の上り車線は通行止めとなっておりますまた事件の重要参考人であるエド・ブラウン氏も消息を絶っており BCP では彼の行方を追っております逃走したイングラム容疑者は産業エリアへ逃亡したとの情報があり現在産業エリアへの道路は規制されていますなおイングラム容疑者は銃を奪って逃走しており付近の住民には厳重な注意を呼びかけております
各検問所では BCP の指示に従ってください容疑者ジョナサン・イングラムは元ポリスノーツとして BCP の基盤を築いたオリジナルコップとして知られ今回の事件は関係者に大きなショックを与えていますそれでは BCP 本部長のゲイツ・ベッカー氏の共同記者会見の模様をご覧ください私はイングラムとは旧友だったポリスノーツ以来の今回のことは非常に残念だイングラムがここまで追い詰められているとは私が力になってやればよかった彼のことは私が同じポリスノーツとして責任を持って処置する彼は今危険な状態にある重度のナーク中毒者だおそらく正常な意識はないだろうした以上 BBC からお伝えしました。Hello, you. Here is the news. So, Gates, me. Skikat to need to hear. Kore mo CG? So, yo. CG go say no nise mono. Watashi no alibi o sykes through the many. On say mo back mo ezo mo minna go say yo. Watashi de at the watashi janai no. Dare mo kizuka nai de shone. News so no mono mo de chiang dash na. Wow, 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 okay. It's okay, nothing's bugged. Oh, there's my watch. This is your watch. It's crazy. Let's try to find a new car. Maybe... No, I don't need to find a new car. I'm going to go to Lorraine. I'm going to go to Lorraine. Yeah, Mother was surprised I still had it. It's bad it can't be fixed. is on the news. Maybe I'll watch some more. Might be another news report. Okay.本日未明、連続殺人の容疑でホームへ強制送還されることになっていたジョナサン・イングラム容疑者を乗せた護送車が宇宙港へ向かう途中、BBCのテレビ中継車との接触事故により爆発炎上。乗っていたイングラム容疑者は現在もなお逃走中指名手配されておりますこの事故で BCP、BBC 局員数名が軽傷を負い宇宙航線の上り車線は通行止めとなっておりますまた事件の重要参考人であるエド・ブラウン氏も消息を絶っており BCP では彼の行方を追っております逃走したイングラム容疑者は産業エリアへ逃亡したとの情報で現在産業エリアへの道路は規制されていますなおイングラム容疑者は銃を奪って逃走しており付近の住民には厳重な注意を呼びかけております各検問所では BCP の指示に従ってください容疑者ジョナサン・イングラムは元ポリスノーツとして BCP の基盤を築いたオリジナルコップとして知られ今回の事件は関係者に大きなショックを与えていますそれでは BCP 本部長の私の共同記者会見の思い出をお願いします。I suppose it's a bit like BBC. Well, I say BBC News. It's a bit like the news we have here. Like there's some rolling channels that would just show the same story every half hour. I suppose it's a bit like BBC News. It's a bit like BBC News. 
They do acknowledge it in the beginning. They say BBC, the Brits. No, it's the same, same, uh, same letters, different group. BCP no Kisa Club からの中継でした。以上、カレン法上がお伝えしました。Check out the TV again. Oh, yeah, real thrilling to wake up to John. Are you still got your globe? Even if one of its parts is disturbed, the entire system collapses. Balance is crucial. If we started moving in the wrong direction, Beyond would lose its balance too. Do you know how the shrimp survive in here? They're protected by the biosphere's order, I guess. No, it's more than that. How do they survive then? They support each other. That's why it has to be two, doesn't it? Right, it's the most important element in it of any biosphere. Love. Right, well, it's Jonathan, so let's get the obvious out of the way. You really like that outfit, huh? You're always wearing it. I like this colour. I've got a few of these. It's not like I'm wearing the same one all the time. Come on, John, are you not going to go in for a feel? As if you can talk. You're like a Kata... Kitagiri Suzume? What is a Kitagiri Suzume when it's at home? Kita what? Kitagiri Suzume. That's a Japanese expression for someone who wears the same clothes all the time. So I'm a Kitakiri Suzumi. I didn't bring any of the clothes with me. This is what I wore when I left home. Really? I'm buying new pairs of underwear as I go along, and I'm borrowing shirts and stuff from Ed. Oh, so as one got old, uh. Bit, nah, nah. Does this person wear the same clothes all the time? I don't know. Are you still got your phone? You talk to the station a lot on that? No, I don't use it for work that much. The hospital told me to always have my phone on me. If they find a match, the transplant coordinator will contact me. Oh yeah, she has um, an illness. She has a bone, def bone marrow deficiency, I think it was. And she's kind of sick constantly. So I keep it with me at all times, just in case. A lot of people ask him the same shirt. Oh. Um. Yeah, maybe get some new clothes, my dude. I guess. I like to wear something casual when I'm not working. You've still got your jar. You've still got your jar. The thing's bugged. What if it's a jar of humbugs, though? You ever thought of that? How's your health, Karen? They say the disease is progressing. You look really drained. My doctor said I should be in the hospital right now, but I can't imagine being there at a time like this. You all right? Not really, no. But don't worry, I won't get in your way or anything. It's been night time. It's all right, there's nobody out there. This is adjustable glass, but you should probably stay away from the windows anyway. I went straight through an ad break. Sorry, folks. <laughs> Never know who might be watching. Uh, I don't think there are going to be new any CD, any new CDs for me to play. All right, let's you and me have a chat. Karen, what's up? Ask about her job. What about you and work? Andy, our news director, he's taking care of things for us. He said we just. To just stay put for now and keeping an eye on you here while my evil twin tells the world you're a psycho is he a boyfriend a long time ago maybe we're not seeing each other anymore using an ai in place of me so we should be okay only andy and a small number of people at the station know about it no one would ever suspect that's not the real you How are you holding up? Not very well. They're suppressing the disease with drugs for now. I can't die yet. Until I know the truth and put everything behind me. 
Are you in any pain? No, but I'm scared. I don't want to die alone. They still not found a donor? No, they say there might not be anyone for me on beyond. Watch Jonathan save the day at the end. I don't know. Transplant costs. Looks like dad got me moved up. I'm so grateful for everything he's done. We're the only station that still talks about Beyond's drug problem to any degree. Tokugawa controls the media too, do they? Most places, but not everyone. And not us. We can't just not cover a story like this though. Looks like people are buying what they're saying about you. If we can just find some evidence, we should be able to clear your name. Yep. We need to prove you're innocent, and that's BCP's lying. The question is how? Is it open up? The rain, okay. Pare.俺と<笑> 俺は彼女との生活を優先するため、ポリスノーツに志願した。当時はまさか選抜されるなんて夢にも思っていなかった。訓練期間中はヒューストンで幸せな1年間を送った。あの頃は夢のようだった。それがあの火星行きだ。
anything in the study, maybe? Try to relax, Jonathan, please. Oh, she's not letting me move anywhere else. Okay. Still something to talk about, I guess. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> Thank you. Whiff. Yeah, yeah, that's true. So dad got me moved up. What else is there to talk about? So people are buying what they're saying about you. But damn vinyl and cassettes, man. What if what a future. What a time to be alive. Oh, open up about my feelings. Karen. Smanai.俺は君の家庭をめちゃめちゃにした。その上君までも巻き込んでしまった。ジョナサン言わないで。私あなたに会って分かった。今まで誤解してた母のことあなたのこと。この時計見てたらあなたのことよくわかる。人の心って本当は
Numerous large deposits were made recently into a joint bank account of theirs. They probably located buyers from lists Tokugawa had. Tokugawa wanted rid of them after he found out about it. But you, I bet you Hojo tried to use that CD to blackmail Tokugawa. I think I'm safe here? Haven't they caught on to what's going on? Probably. Things went too well. They could always be planning to get rid of you some other way. One that doesn't draw any suspicion towards them. I wonder if me and Karen are safe here. Well, both BBC and Karen could potentially be working with them. That's ridiculous. At this point, I don't bloody know. They probably are. <laughs> Anything could happen. Hojo's motive. Why did Hojo start doing something like that? Most likely to get money for Karen's transplant. There are also levels of priority on the waiting list. Karen's level was upgraded last month. He must have handed out some bribes. I can't see someone like Hojo getting involved in something like that just for money. Well, Karen's an only child. She doesn't have any siblings. It's not easy finding a bone marrow donor for someone in that situation. But if it was just for money, that is pretty thin. So what about his accomplice? Was that Ishida's motive? His, his, his is clear cut. Money. Money? That and a grudge against Tokugawa. He wasn't very impressed with the way he'd been treated. Despite their differences, they were both after money. It was the perfect opportunity for both of them, though it doesn't seem like they were very close. Ishida had been caught embezzling money from a company a number of times. That's apparently why he was transferred to BCCH in the first place. That's my stab at Ishida's motive. Didn't have any serious rep sheet, but the guy wasn't a Boy Scout either. What happened to all of the poppies and capsules at the factory? We hacked the records of Tokugawa Shipping Company. Not long after we left, a convoy of 20 trucks was sent over to Tokugawa Pharmaceuticals. They just moved the operation somewhere else. They've cleaned out every last piece of evidence. The capsules were sold to users directly through BCZH's pharmacy. 70% of the outpatients who bought them from, from the pharmacy over the last several months have records of possession. I see. As you'd expect, they didn't keep records of the transactions at the pharmacy. Users would pay by wiring money to a bank account Hojo and Ishida had prepared under false names. No one at the hospital would suspect anything, and they could do it all themselves. Unfortunately, we can't find any capsules anywhere. I doubt we'd find anything at the home of buyers at this point either. Damn. It'd be hard proving anything without capsules or poppies. These guys ain't stupid. They've taken care of everything. How much of AP does Tokugawa control? Gates and Tokugawa have been in it together from the beginning. They must control virtually everyone in AP, not to mention Redwood. I got the results from that blood analysis, by the way. Oh, blood analysis. Go, Victor. I wonder what that's going to re result in. What about BCP? To be honest, we don't know how far they've infiltrated the place. Don't expect anyone there to help us. Everyone we talk to is scared shitless. This is Tokugawa we're dealing with. can't really count on anyone outside BCP for help either. People don't fight Takagawa here. He's totally above the law. Leno 
全盛期に開発された不素化合物を主原料とした第一世代の人工血液で次に人間のヘモグロビンを遺伝子操作して作られる粉末タイプの第二世代人工ヘモグロビン最後に今世紀に開発された完全に人工合成された第三世代人工血球の3つ中でも白い設計球の特徴を持つタイプは第一世代だけらしい現在このタイプの球人工血液は一般での使用は禁止されているとのことだ使用許可が許されているのは一時的な血液の補給を目的とする分野 AP に限られるらしい使用者の特定はああ残念だがこの球タイプには拒絶反応を起こすような表面構造を持っておらず血液型がないということだしたがってレッドウッドとは特定できないしかしやつの使用している血液タイプと同じものであるということは言えるわけだうん It's never got around to checking the dialyzer data but it was full of narc whoever he is he's a real fan of the stuff the reason they kept going like that comes from the allergic effects of the drug how was redwood not injured after all that he was he was hospitalized under a false name the story about him having gone to pick up new amps ship was bullshit he probably hasn't re fully recovered in such a short amount of time he looked pretty good though in the cutscene we saw he was standing pretty firm uh, what about dave any idea what happened to dave oh it's now called dave and you it's a totally stupid name they should never have changed it meryl looked into it like she was saying she found dave's blood all over redwood's goddard they had to have carried dave's body away in his emps do you think they took him no idea he's definitely not around bcp the real question is why would they want to hide his body that is a very good question why would they want to hide his body what do you think they took him no idea he's definitely not around bcp if me and Karen are safe here well both BBC and Karen could potentially be working with them mm. is this a trap is this part of a trap why are they being so indirect you're a terrestrial meaning your trial would take place on home you're not a beyond so you couldn't be tried here they use that lie detector that analyzes a person's p300 brainwaves in trials on home they're probably afraid you'd expose everything. They want to eliminate you before you take it back to home. If that means they have to be indirect when then that's what they'll do, I suppose. Nanikaite <laughs> 物的証拠として挙げられている VTR もうまく作られているよ潜入した時撮ったお前の映像と北条の映像をうまく合成しているこのまま奴らの思うがままかいや物的証拠になりえないものが一つあるそれは北条の死体だよジョナさん死体は嘘をつかないいくら細工してもな How'd you figure? 北条の解剖処刑はそれが妙なんだ石田の時と同じく BCP での解剖は行われていないなぜか BCCH の病理へ回されているまた BCCH か北条の死因に関してビクトルが気になることを言っていた Okay Seems Hojo's body is at BCCH Alright, what did Victor say? 気になることって北条の死体には確かに生活反応もあり死亡時刻は4時間前だったが死因や遺体状態がおかしいと言っていたどういうふうに石田の時と同じく殺しのサインとなる皮下出血や防御層がどこにも見つからないそれに銃弾が必ずしも致命傷ではないようだ死因は別にあると言っていた死因は別にあるそれからあの死亡推定時刻も怪しいらしい
通常4時間も経つと小さな筋肉は硬直していないとおかしいらしいビクトルは死体の VTR を見ただけだが銃弾が打ち込まれた時にはすでに脳死状態にあった形跡が見られたらしい脳死状態だって脳死体の生命機能を維持するために投与される特殊な薬品による兆候があったというんだそれじゃあ北条はずっと以前に殺されていたというのかああそういうことになるな脳死体を使ったトリックだ、はあ、OK so where is Victor? ビクトルと連絡は取れないのかそれがビクトルは北条の死体を解剖するとか言って BCCH へ出かけたまま帰らないんだ連絡もない何かあったに違いないじいさん無茶しやがっていいかジョナサン BCCH だあそこのモルグに北条の遺体があるはずだビクトルのことも気がかりだどうやら俺はおとりらしいわかるなジョナサン少し危険だが BCCH 行くんだ俺は泳がされてる分かったヤツらの相手を頼んだぞ随分と長電話をしてしまったなああ悪かったおかげで AP のヤツらがおいでなすったもう切るぞエド俺のベレッタはえご掃除に盗み出してカレンさんに渡したはずだがカレンにじゃあ切るぞエドの言う通りよ銃は私が持ってるわカレンうかつだったわねジョナサン覚悟なさいカレンそのまま受話器をゆっくりと置いて分かった本気のようだな変なことを考えない方がいいわよ銃の使い方くらいは分かってるわどうするつもりだそうねこっちに来てキスしなさいカレンどうびっくりしたでしょ<笑>本気だと思ったはいあなたの重回数はねさい<笑> That was a cool reveal BCCH へ乗り込むんでしょカレン父の本当の死因を知りたいもの私そんなに長く生きられないのだから時間を無駄にしたくないカレンあなたと一緒にいたいの母の分までそれに BCCH は私詳しいのよ3日に一度は通ってるから案内できるあ,あジョナさん大丈夫なのか体の具合良くないんだろう悪くなっても大丈夫病院へ行くんですものねジョナサン<笑>納得いく説明だ分かった BCCH へ急ごう了解探偵さん Oh Karen What are we gonna do with you? Why are you insulting business logic? What, does, what has business logic done to deserve such a thing? BCCH に着いたわよ誰もいないようね夜の病院はいいもんじゃないな怖いのちょっとね弱虫いや病院は苦手なんだポリスノーツになるとき体中を嫌っていうほど調べられたんだそれ以来ねあの頃は誰でもが宇宙へ行ける時代じゃなかったものね君は大丈夫なのか私行きたいから生き延びたいから検査も怖くないすまなかった行こうか
Okay. Act four. Because he likes foul Xenos gum. Oh. That's one of the hospital's lights. It automatically comes on when it gets dark. No one will ever get forget to hit the switch. SBCCH sign. It's hard to make out the writing. Side doors open again. Hey, the doors open. That's the entrance to the emergency room. It's always open for obvious reasons. I see. You really do know your way around this place. We can enter here. Oh, okay. I was wondering when I was going to go through there. We can go inside through the emergency room entrance over there. It, the sky looks cracked. Or is that other stars? The glass biodome isn't cracked, is it? That'd be bad. All right, inside we go. Those have been modified to deter insects. They emit an odor that they find offensive. I thought there weren't any insects on Beyond. It's not like there are none at all. I think it's buildings. Oh, it may... maybe. I don't actually know. Maybe the stars in an odd shape. I don't know. We just have the bare minimum necessary to support the Celes. Okay. You say so. Let me in. It's nice for patients to be able to see these from anywhere inside. Here we go. ロビーよ。誰もいないみたい。こんな時間だものね。金。モルグはどこに確か地下にあるって聞いたわ。yeah, Mogs always in the basement. I don't have ever visited any Mogs. But if video games have told me anything, they're always in the basement. What you could be seeing is seems between the panels of the oh maybe, maybe. Space stations in Japanese logic a bit like cylinders due to no gravity. Oh yes, I believe we're on a Taurus. Which is kinda like a big big flying donut in space. Oh, Gundam made it famous. Oh, fair enough. You can see outside with all the city lights. It really is quiet, isn't it? Napoleon has thoroughly checked out of here, thank goodness. What do you want to sit down for? You feeling tired? Can't stop here. There's no point in hanging around here. We should get to the morgue. Will the sign will tell us? That's a board for directions. It's off right now, but I know my way around here. Someone might see us if we stay here too long. Try to board, but it's off right now, of course. I have to wait here watching these boards for my number to appear. Someone might see us. Sorry, it's a visual novel. No one's going to see us. Okay, fine. I'll go, I'll go. Oh my god. Is, uh, what's her name? Oh my god, what was her name? Goldwyn? Goldwyn could not be in the director's office, could she? If we wander around, someone will see us. Okay, I guess we can't go there anyway. To the morgue we go. Happy times. It's Jonathan, he won't have a problem doing that. ここよ。この病院のモルグは真っ暗だと何も見えん。ジョナサン、どこかに電気のスイッチがあるはずよ。分かった。手探りで探してみよう。I see four things. Who's going to bet there's a jump scare? I'm putting money a jump scare. I'm going to have five dollars on there being a jump scare. Hmm? a switch on the panel. Tight 
タッチセンサーかスイッチに光が灯ったわこれでいくらかは見えるよしえっとどれが電気のスイッチだろう慎重にね何のスイッチかわからないんだから That never stopped me pushing all the buttons in a video game before. All right, let's have a chat. I bet Jonathan has something to say about her looking nice under these lights or something. What is it, Jonathan? We need to find the light switch. All right, and find the switch. There it is. Ah, where are you? Ah, well, I didn't see it. So, do you think that's a lie? I don't think so. ジョーナーさんこんな時にふざけないでうっす、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あっ、あ You stop it. Okay. Got that out of the way. We know Jonathan still is the same old self. Ah! I could agree to that because these are not new structures for sci fi. It's a plausible solution to make artificial gravity. Yep, fair enough. All right. Top switch, maybe? Yes. Now we're going to switch. Hmm? なんだろうこの音空調が作動したんじゃないかしらなるほどこれは空調のスイッチかなんだか寒いわ分かった空調を切るよジョーナさんお願いよしっかりしてわあ、I'm pressing buttons like you wanted, Karen それじゃこのスイッチはどうだ警報かやばいはやっちって早く Should know by now I'm all predicted Karen. This <laughs> is the air conditioning switch, not the light switch. Alarm switch, better not press it again. Okay, what's behind switch number three? This is the switch. Slow down, Jonathan. Don't worry, Karen. There's no need to be a morgue, it's fine. ダメこういうのいや待てよこれダミーだよく見てみろあら本当作り物ね映画の特殊メイクなんかで使うものだわ一度スタジオで見たことがあるどうなってるんだこの病院はそれにしても気味悪いわね Oh man, I never got a chat switch number four. Can I move to the switches? Nope. Oh well, switch number four's functionality will remain a mystery. It's a terminal for managing the bodies. Look, it's got a list of all the bodies that have been through here. This type of terminal is automated by 3D data codes. Let's see. There were five bodies sent to the number seven factory on the moon today. We just missed them. They left here five hours ago. Where is this number seven factory? Hold on. I'll check. Me, Imbrium, Plato Crater, Plato Crater. Plateau? Huh. Tokugawa moon plant. Why are bodies from beyond being sent to Tokugawa's moon plant? Plato? 
That's it. The Plato your father was talking about before he disappeared wasn't Pluto. It was the Plato crater. What about my father's body? The name's on here. He was sent there today. So he isn't among the bodies here? We should check those bodies over there. If what this terminal says is right, we'll have to go to the moon to find your father. To the moon! And then what's in this? What's this? Look, there's a window on it. You'll see what's inside. Am I sure I want to do that? Ooh, blinky lights. It's a container for transporting lunar minerals. It's got the Tokugawa logo on it. Maybe they didn't have enough room on the last flight. This will be going to the moon too, I'll bet. Definitely says the destination is the Tokugawa number no. 7 factory. Mare Imbrium. In other words, the Plato Crater. Uh, let's have a look inside. いや、肌を見ろ。おそらく脳死状態の培養モートだ。Oh shit, Victor, no! Oh, God damn it. I gotta get him out of this. It's too late, Jonathan. He's already gone. Who knows? There might still be a chance. We don't know what could happen if we open this. Hey, Cadet Wolf, welcome back. You still live in your head hurts? Oh no. Let him go, Jonathan. There's nothing we can do for him now. Oh, poor Victor. What happened, Victor? What the hell happened? How many people do they have to kill? Okay. Ugh. Some sort of storage container. I wonder what it's for. Storing things, Karen, what do you think? Oh god. This door's incredibly thick. We must really want to protect whatever's inside. Uh can I open it? Yes. What? A kidney? It's a kidney. That's obvious what that is. It's a heart. Rip straight from my ex-wife. Hey oh Nandate Koreba Dave no Jinzo Rashi. Dave Sante BCP no Kajida Edo no Bukan. You could have made it under. Do ste coconi so not Dave San the Jinzo Garwake? What the hell? Why is Dave's body parts here? It's a picture of Dave. Kidney's time of removal and donor compatibility data are written here. It's a diagram of the body. One of the kidney areas has been highlighted in red. This is a diagram of the organs that have been removed. 
Any red dots represent the ones they've taken out. See the Tokugawa logo here. Sounds like human spare parts. We must be at the HR department. The term human resources always did rub me the wrong way. <laughs> Tokugawa logo, the three hollyhock leaves. And what's this thing here? It's got the Tokugawa number seven factory stamp on it. That's probably where it came from. Came from? Is this Dave's heart? それじゃあこっちのは誰のだ見ろこれはBCCHの石田の心臓だプレートにドナーのデータが記載されているおおイシダズハーツオッケーでもこの人の顔は違うこれは違うこれは違うこれは違うこれは違うこれは違うこれは
Just like that terminal says, my father's body has been sent to the moon. Jesus said. バリだ。こっちも慣れんのでな、こういうところは。つけられなかったか。大丈夫だ。メリルが俺の階段を押してくれてる。メリルも気をつけないと危険だな。で、どうだった?工場の死体は。それが変なんだ。この あるのは偽物の人形だけだ。みんな徳川の月面工場に送られてる。月面工場。それは妙だ。ビクトルは。ビクトルなら。そこに眠ってる。手遅れだった。なんてこった。じいさん。まさか。じいさんも大王モートに
株主見学ツアーとは考えたもんだだがサルバトーレに気づかれると大変だぞ大丈夫だ宇宙服を着ていれば見つかる宇宙服なんて着るの何年ぶりだろうさあジュナさんフェイスプレートの濃度を上げろ音声出力も変調させておくんだぞ分かってる石田のやり方ならしかし宇宙服を着るときぐらいタバコを離したらどうだこれがないと落ち着かない死ぬまで何かに頼って生きるつもりかエドまあ、い,いサルバトーレの話を聞こうそれとなく大学校について探りを入れてみるんだ本来なら船内服のようなラフな格好でご案内したいのですが当工場は宇宙ホテルのような設備が整っておりません一気圧に余圧されていますが安全のために宇宙服は着たままでお願いしますそれでは私だけ喋っていても退屈でしょうから皆様からの質問を頂戴したいと思います月面工場の全貌と各設備はここから窓越しに見渡せます皆様のバイザー内のアイポイントセンサーと連動していますので指示は目線で分かりますさあどなたかご質問は How convenient. These are Tokugawa shareholders. Must have a lot of free time if they can afford to come to a place like this. I can't see any of their faces. That's Salvatore. We can't let him catch us. Let's stay towards the back. Don't keep looking at him. Our visor sensors are linked. He'll get suspicious. Talk to him. Excuse me, can I ask a question? Yes, you back there. Ask about. Go ahead, ask anything you want. Oh, okay. Run out of questions?、Uh, no, I want to have a look around outside first. Those are the solar parabolic mirrors for generating electricity. They provide a good chunk of the energy we use here. The moon takes about 27 days to orbit Earth, so they operate for the 14 or so days of sunlight here, changing their angles according to the position of the sun. There's no loss of energy to the atmospheric absorption, so they can collect about 1.5 times more energy than similar mirrors on Earth. We also use solar energy in making the concrete used for construction here. Neat. We're presently not using that factory for manufacturing purposes. It's being used solely as a makeshift warehouse at the moment. There's nothing of interest there, oh, isn't there? I'll be the judge of that. That big ramp. That's the mass driver, a giant catapult driven by a linear motor. To put it simply, it launches payloads towards L2 at speeds of over 2.4 kilometers a second. That object that looks like a track is an acceleration rail that launches linear motor cars, so called,、uh, also called buckets. The rail is almost 7 kilometers long. L2 is Lagrange point two. Mm hmm. It doesn't use any liquid hydrogen or liquid oxygen for fuel, so it's more economical than rocket based transportation. The materials are caught by a mass catcher at L2. One big giant fuck off net, I bet. Catapult with a linear motor. Wouldn't a catapult need a rotating motion? I'm, I guess maybe they're thinking about it more as like maybe a slingshot. You know, like you, you put something on it, you pull it back maybe, and then choing, off it goes. Maybe? I don't know. Our windows are reinforced with three layers of two inch thick lead glass to help protect against the high levels of cosmic radiation here. Like a long sled sort of thing. Maybe, maybe. Man, 
That model of the Tokugawa building captured every detail of the real thing. Even with this level of protection, shutters are automatically lowered during periods of intense solar flare activity to provide additional reinforcement. Why was my, one of my options break? <laughs> yeah, just yeah, just go ahead and break that. I'm sure everybody's standing around will let you break that glass. This glass can't be broken with your bare hands. It isn't like what you see in them old sci-fi movies. At the very least, you would need some sort of tool to break it. Oh. Okay. Ah, oh, there's the Earth. I can see my house. The synchronization of the moon's sidereal rotation and revolution periods means that Earth is always visible from here. Being able to see the Earth, or home, as it's often called, is a comfort for those who work on the moon. I'm happy to take any questions on areas besides the plant's facilities, too. No one's asking any questions. Their eyes are probably glazed over. Should we try asking something? Yes, yes, let's try. Excuse me, can I ask a question? Yes, you at the back. Feel free to ask me anything you like. Okay, I'll ask you about the plant. Oh my god, there's a lot here. Location. The Tokugawa Mu plant is located on the near side of the moon in the Plato Crater, which is itself situated on the northern shore of Mare Imbrium, the moon's second largest mare. Mare Imbrium means Sea of Rains. The Plato Crater is approximately 100 kilometers in diameter, with its smooth floor widely known as one of the darkest places on the moon. That's where Pink Floyd recorded their album. It's a considerable distance to the nearest base, so you could say we're pretty isolated here. The only way to get here is by LSM from a lunar orbiton space station. Oh my goodness, uh, energy. The plant is powered by solar energy as well as helium-3 nuclear fusion. We gather solar energy through the parabolic mirrors you were looking at. Helium-3 is almost non-existent on Earth, but is found in relatively large quantities here on the Moon. We were able to produce one kilo of Helium-3 from 100,000 tons of lunar regolith. I'm learning so many terminologies and things. There are numerous minerals found in abundance on the Moon, such as ilmenite, for example. We mine and process these, and what we don't use here is exported to Earth as space colonies such as beyond. Nearly all the materials used to construct the plant have come from lunar resources. After processing, the minerals are exported via the mass driver you were looking at. Helium-3 nuclear fusion, unlike conventional nuclear fission, is a virtually clean process that doesn't give off any secondary radiation. Isn't that good? The moon, with its low gravity, Ultra low temperature and high vacuum sterile environment allows us to manufacture made on the moon drugs and other products with very high purity. We've also been in charge with overseeing various life science experiments. Since no organisms naturally exist here, there's no risk of contamination, and its vacuum environment also eliminates the possibility of a biohazard occurring. Oh yeah, I should get to that uh, conspiracy thing I was talking about before I before a whole load of action started. So I was in the queue for shopping today. Um, I was walking up to the aisle to put my shopping on the trolley, uh, on the conveyor belt. And as I was approaching the conveyor belt, I saw this guy, like this really big guy with two takeaways in his hand and he was heading straight for the same th same checkout aisle I was I was going to, but managed to beat him to it. Didn't make eye contact or anything. And um, as I was putting my shopping down, I just happened to glance back at him and he only had these two takeaway things. And I stood just stood there thinking to myself, are you really going to uh, check out 
at, at this at this thing with with only two takeaways why don't you go to the self-service checkout like a normal person would and just get you two things and just be on your way i've got a lot of shopping here you're gonna be a while and i wasn't the only one who thought that because one of the staff came along and then said hey excuse me sir you've only got two items would you like to go to the self-service checkout and he said no thank you i i don't want to use those and she said are you sure and he said, yes, I don't want to use them under any circumstances. And the staff asked, uh, why don't you want to use them? And he said, no word of a lie. He said, because they're a form of control. They use those to jack up the prices. It's all about mind control. I refuse to use those checkout counters under any circumstances. And I was just like, I stopped for a moment and I went, did I hear that right? Self-service self checkout machines are a form of mind control. <laughs> okay, buddy. Keep your distance. That's far enough. I don't want you to have any more contact with me or anybody else here. I'm leaving with my shopping. Thank you very much. It was a <clears throat> wild, wild thing to just eavesdrop in on, but... Self-service checkouts, form of mind control. Be wary of that, everybody. It's 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 a real thing. Anyway, back to the story. We carry out such non-production related operations under the watchful eye of the United Nations Committee on the Peaceful Uses of Outer Space. That is a new one. Mm-hmm, certainly is. I'm like, okay, well... I'm just going to use my voucher because I get a fiver off my shopping. Which I don't think you can do at the self-service checkout thingies. And I'll be on my way. Thank you very much. What about your staff? The employees we have working here include computer engineers, geologists, astronomers, physicists, biologists, chemists, space medical scientists, doctors, architects, and security officers such as myself, well, all employees of the Tokugawa Group. We'll have a little under 60 employee... Oh, sorry, we have a little under 60 employees, Tokyo. We're inspected by the UN twice a year, but apart from that, it's just us here. So, <laughs> this is a little bit, doesn't it? There are no intervening government organizations. We have a total of seven factories in the moon plant, numbered from one through seven. Each factory manufactures a variety of moon-related products round the clock. The insides of the factories all contain sensitive business information, so I'm afraid I'm unable to show you inside any of them. For instance, I'm sure you are aware that the very effective helium-3 purification process in use here is a patent of the Tokugawa Group. There are certain areas I can't touch upon for confidentiality reasons. Thank you for your understanding. Okay. It's no longer being used for production, even so, I'm unable to show you inside. We'll have to settle for looking at it from here. Alright, what about the moon then? Data. The moon's radius is 1,738 kilometers, or one fourth of Earth's. Its average distance from Earth is 385,000 kilometers. And it orbits it at a speed of just over one kilometer per second. <coughs> oh boy. 
<coughs> All this talking's getting to me. Its gravity is one sixth of Earth's, and its mass one eight uh, and its mass one eighty first. Ugh, drink time. Oh, come on, throat, you can do this. Oh, the, woo, spinny ball. Thank you. I will uh, hydrate again. Oh boy. A day on the moon is equal to 27 days and 7 hours on Earth, taking nearly one month to complete a full rotation. To the far southeast, <coughs> you'll find Mare Tranquilli Tranquillitatis, or Sea of Tranquility where astronauts Armstrong and Aldrin landed near the equator with Apollo 11. The footprints they left behind have been preserved and are now a famous tourist destination. <clears throat> to the west of here, you can see the beautiful Sinus Iridium, which translates to Rainbow Bay. Just lo located just to the south is Archimedes Crater. A city that will house some 10,000 people is currently under construction there. It's scheduled to be completed in about 10 years time. Located to the south. Okay, read that one already. <coughs> I am no longer in a dungeon, basically. A linear motor. Oh, okay. A linear motor is the type of ledge motor that turns a rotation motion of a motor to direct an update in a linear motion. I've sent a picture of an example. I would admit my knowledge on these is not that extensive. Fair enough. Neither is mine. Oh, you sent that picture through... <clears throat> Where'd you send me that picture? Oh, you PM'd it. Did you? Oh. <coughs> oh, boy. Sorry. Throat's doing one now. Oh, right. Okay. What is a linear induction motor? Winding rotor. Ah, okay. Fair enough. Feel free to link that in chat for anybody who's, uh, who might be curious. <coughs> oh dear. Not very interested in the moon, ain't you? Development. It's been over 70 years since the first Apollo landing and over 30 years since man returned to the moon and completed the first manned moon base. Located in Oceanus Prol Proceli Procellarum, or Ocean of Storms. Gone by the five-stage plan for lunar development proposed by German engineer, uh, space engineer Dr. Kraft Enrich. We have finally arrived at the fourth stage as we attempt to expand manufacturing capabilities and improve the living environment on the moon. If a lunar city can be successfully completed, we'll be witnessing the birth of a new paradigm. However, development on the far side of the moon is a different story. At present, it's only used for such purposes as housing radio telescopes. Oops. There are several theories in regard to the origin of the moon. The giant impact theory states that the moon is a result of a collision between celestial bodies. Then there's the fission theory, which says that the moon was once part of Earth. There is also the confirmation theory, which states that the moon was formed out of the same gas as Earth. Another theory the capture theory says that the moon was captured by Earth's gravitational pull. As of now, no theory has, proven, has been proven correct. The Grange points so I will have a dig on some more physics notes, but they are a rather important scientific discovery because it allows us to have objects placed there for science, specific scientific purposes, for example, observing the sun or the universe itself. Yeah? <coughs> When we were working on System Shock, I actually had to do a little bit of research into the L system of things because Saturn, I believe, has 
five Lagrange points. L1, L2, L3, L4, L5. L6 doesn't exist, but System Shock has Citadel Station in L6 orbit. But that doesn't exist. So I had, I, yeah, I just did some research that and I was like, huh, that doesn't actually exist. They just made it up for the game. It was rather interesting, but yeah, I did learn about that. If development on the moon advances to the point where we can conclusively determine its internal composition, a, defini a definitive answer should finally emerge. Oh, one sorry, one sec. There we go, sorry about that. The spacesuits. The spacesuits you all wear in a semi-hard extravehicular mobility units, or EMUs made from materials such as aluminium alloys and stainless steel. That composition allows the suit's internal pressure to be set at 0.7 bar, thus reducing the depressurization time on spaceships and space bases. You may find them... <clears throat> <coughs> Sorry. You may find them somewhat difficult to move in, but various parts like the arms, legs and boots made out of materials such as polyester and urethane resin, which I think helps keep any real discomfort to a minimum. Also, the soles of your boots and the carpeting inside the plant are both covered with Velcro, making it easier to walk. I can assure you the spacesuits are completely safe. Like the outside walls of space colonies and this plant, they're covered with optical fiber. Should any dent or cracks form in the suit, that fibre will bend, activating an alarm. We can prevent any accidents resulting from wear in the metal before they occur. Your emus are also equipped with a urine collection device, as well as a supply of drinking water. Though the two ain't connected, <laughs> instructions can be found on your visor's hood. important points. In the interest of safety, please do not go near any of the restricted areas. The number 7 factory is particularly dangerous due to the contaminated material stored inside. I'm sure it is dangerous. When I explained about the glass here a moment ago, I said there's no need to worry about cosmic radiation. We can indeed avoid direct sunlight here because the plant is located at the bottom of a crater. However, should you find yourself elsewhere during the solar maximum, please be sure to avoid any direct sunlight. There's a real danger of high level radiation exposure. Yep, <clears throat> whenever you're out sunbathing, you are getting radiated a little bit. I'm going to have to wrap up the questions in a minute. As the plant contains sensitive business information, use of cameras, video recorders or virtual recorders is not permitted anywhere inside the facility. As the plant contains sensitive business information... Oh, I already read that one. I hope I've satisfied your curiosity. Unfortunately, that's about all the time we have. We'll need to be moving on now. <laughs> We've done a sneak. LSM が月周回ステーションへ帰っていく。これでもう帰れないぞ。アルキメデスクレーターまで歩いていくわけにはいかん。覚悟はいいな。LSM が向こうに着くまで乗客のチェックはない。それまで俺たちは自由に行動できる。やはり第七工場だ。あそこが怪しい。さっきもサルバトーレの応対がおかしかったしな
北条の死体は第七工場に送られたことになっていたんださあ第七工場を調べに行こう中央案内所だ閉めたぞ誰もいないようだおぼい Yeah, you would have thought that they would have done a passenger check before the thing took off. Never mind, plot be plot. Don't question it too much. Ooh, triangle. Look, this is made out of paper. Yeah, the moon has one sixth the gravity of home, so materials don't need to be as strong. Paper suffices. It's a paper tape. <clears throat> Paper table. All right. well, that's because there is no Grange Point Six, at least to my knowledge, not even in relations between the Sun and Earth. There are only five. So expect a lot of tra space trash in Lagrange Point. Yeah, that's about. That sounds about right. It just complacent with procedure. Mm-hmm. I think we're going to be breaking a window at some point. Though we're gonna, <clears throat> we're gonna need a tool to be able to do so. That was warehouse number seven, wasn't it? Yeah, here, okay, here we go. That's the number seven factory. There's home. Something else, ain't she? No, how many? No matter how many times I see it out here, it never gets any less beautiful. There's home. Not breaking home. Jeez. Come on. That's the mass driver. They use it to ship lunar resources into spice. Mass. Uh, the solar mirror array. Plants buildings. Oh boy. We're going on a spacewalk. What's that actually? What's this? You can see a lot of the plant from here. Okay, go to break. Have you lost your mind? What would be the point in breaking the glass? How else are we going to get out? Or well, we could just take the door, I guess. Okay. Oi, imps. Why did imps get to the top? The AP is here. That's why the AP is here. That's why the AP is here. ますます怪しいな民間の企業がエンプスを警備に使用してるなんて何が閉鎖中の倉庫だサルバトールのやつ Hi fellas Nice weather we're having today huh <coughs> This is a moon emps An emps modified for use on the moon It's called the Oberth You must be able to pilot it without removing your spacesuit. Oh, birth? Oh, yeah, we have a bunch of terminology we didn't see, did we? Biomort. Yeah, what is a biomort, anyway? A person who is brain dead. Some medical professions. Distinguish between a biomort and a neomort, or someone who has recently become brain dead. Different from a person in a persistent vegetative state, where only the cerebral cortex has stopped functioning. With a biomort, it is the brainstem. The body's own life support system, which is no longer functioning. The cells of a biomorph can be kept alive by giving it hormones or drugs, such as vasopressors, and also by connecting it to artificial organs, such as an artificial respirator. At the end of the 20th century, the criteria for determining brain death varied from country to country, region to region, but a worldwide consensus for establishing brain death was finally reached with the beginning of the Second Space Age in the early 21st century. Good to know. It's a moon treaty. Moon treaty and agreement opened for signature in the United Nations General Assembly on December 18th, 1979, declaring that the moon, along with the rest of outer space, is to be used only for peaceful purposes. 
They also states that the moon, other celestial bodies, and their natural resources are the shared property of all mankind. Its official name is the agreement governing the activities of states on the moon and other celestial bodies. So, Tagas. <laughs> How do you abbreviate that? Tagas. Mos. Mosb. Tagas Mosb. Among other declarations, it strictly prohibits the construction of military bases and facilities, military exercises, weapons testing, and the use of physical force upon or threats toward any celestial body. The United States and Japan were originally non-signatories, but later joined the agreement in the 21st century when lunar development resumed. Nearly every country active in space exploration and development today is a signatory of this agreement. Fine. Sounds like they got some really nasty ideas out of old Soviet experiments. There's a little bit of a link between this and and Russia. Like Victor was from Russia. Um Kojima likes putting characters from all over the world in his games, I think, or at least these early ones. Fun fact, I have not played a Kojima game past Metal Gear Solid 2. I do want to play them. I do want to get the Metal Gears done at some point. A lot of people are looking forward to me playing Metal Gear Solid 3. Because I have not played that one before, so... It should be fun, I guess. I hope. I don't know. I definitely remember a Soviet experiment regarding dogs I can never forget. Ugh, that sounds a bit gross. Now Sam Helium 3. Okay, what's Oberth? Oberth. Metal Gear Solid 3 is your favourite. Oh, fair enough. The only thing I know is it's got a long ladder that everybody likes. Yeah, please spare us. <laughs> Oberth. All right, what's Oberth? A non-registered EMPS used on the Tokugawa moon plant for various operational and defensive purposes. Named after Dr. Herman Oberth, one of the founding fathers of modern rocketry and astronautics. Designed and constructed solely by the Tokugawa group, it is used mainly for mining and transport work, with its pilot wearing a hard suit while on board. One of its notable features is its two large manipulator arms designed for excavating and moving materials. Okay. Good to know. It's also technically the best one to start with. Oh yes, I believe it takes place before everything. Hmm. Fair enough. To those who are curious, look up Sergei. Ryuk on Echo, but I warned you. Eh, call me picky, but I'll cl I'll politely decline. As you mining operations here, their armor pretty light for imps. Their armor doesn't look very thick, probably since they're only used on the moon. This is moon imps. Imps modified. Fuse on the moon. Pally without moving your spacesuit. Okay. I'm gonna guess I press that big green button there. It's the Tokugawa crest. They even got it here. It says contaminated area, no entry. Something doesn't pass the smell test, does it? Let's go see what's really going on. Number seven. Well, it's got a seven on it. I guess this would have to be the number seven factory. Definitely the place. The number factory, the number five factory is where they make Chanel. This is the entrance to the number seven factory. The door's closed. There should be a lock system somewhere. I see an alarm. Hey, here it is. The door's lock system. It's the same as the one at Tokugawa Pharmaceuticals. We could try opening the door with this. Fine, let's press the little green button. Oh, no ID card or gate to Nibosh, you said. Shin Paisuna, or a BCP caracuna dicta. Jonathan, Tobira, my tazo. Oh, boy. 
The door's open, Jonathan. Let's go inside. What is going to be in here? I'm going to guess a whole load of dead bodies. よし、中に入った。表の発注を閉めるぞ。さあ、正面の扉を開けるぞ。待て。もう少しで弦圧が終わる。オッケーだ、オールグリーン。何があるかわからん。ヘルメットはかぶったままで行こう。賛成だ。
It says they're up to a second floor. There's even more up there. We can be disappointed together. Aw. Kirby man, that's not true. I wonder how many bodies they've got here. Let's check out the second floor. Wait! This is a big place. We go wandering around like that and we might trip an alarm. We can record everything from on the second floor from here. Don't go wandering around. Don't want to leave. I want to go forward. How do I how do I go to the back? These life support machines? Yeah. These machines keep the bodies alive as biomorts. Artificial respirators, hearts, lungs, kidneys. Each body is connected to a life support system matching its specific needs. And it's all controlled by computer. The tubes are part of the life support system in use here. If we disconnect these, these people would finally be free. How come you know so much about all this? It's not a hobby or anything. When Catherine got sick, I acquired it all naturally. That's right, I forgot. Sorry. These machines keeping the biomorts alive. Disconnect? These people don't deserve this. Wait! The machines are probably connected to an alarm. Let's go, we need to find Hojo's body. Just go back to beyond empty handed. Let's keep checking around. We should look for Hojo's body. I'm trying. What else could I look at? This thing? What's this? Looks like they're asleep in a way, doesn't it? Where do you think Hojo's body is? Classic adventure game BS of having to click every specific spot. Absolutely. Maybe one of the other people is Hojo. We'll keep looking. This is inhuman. Look at what they've done to these people. Let's check out the other bodies. I think Hojo is here. ダンコンが直してある。ちゃんと保護して。見ろ。臓器が傷つかないように王女はここにずっといたんだ。立証できるか。VTR Yeah, that'd be pretty disturbing, wouldn't it? Here's your father fo floating in a vat. Any questions? random stuff in a server I'm in we spent half an hour trashing on David Cage David Cage I've heard that name he's the game designer isn't he didn't he make uh, Fahrenheit or something okay right hmm 
Isn't the guy he's, who's famous for saying emotions, 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 is, is that him? Jonathan, there's nothing we can do for them now. We came here for evidence. Fine, I will look at every single vat. Or container or whatever. Good to know I can't use that word. You can't use the word emotions? あの。わかったぞ。僕らは王城が行方不明になったのも石田の言いかけたらもっと恐ろしいことっていうのは雑木密売のことだった。俺たちは目先のことしか見てなかった。奴らが隠そうと躍起になっていたのはマークの件ではなくこのことだった。この通りだ、ジョナサン。誰だ
自分が何をしてるか分かってるのか分かってるさ事前事業だ誰もができないことを我々がやってるもちろん金はいただくがね宇宙開発の陰にはドラッグと臓器が必要だ人類は宇宙環境に適応できない漆黒の宇宙空間あの孤立感選ばれて訓練されたものでも頭がおかしくなるジューナさんお前もよく理解できるだろう薬なしのクリーンな宇宙旅行はせいぜいこの月までだだから許されるというのかたかが麻薬だ我々は麻薬がなければ生きてゆけんのだそして降り注ぐ宇宙船無重量人体や遺伝子にさまざまな影響が出る薬と同様宇宙開発には臓器のスペアが必要なんだ見ろこのバイオモート人類のスペア部品だ宇宙開発で傷つき病んだ我々を救ってくれるここは6分の1時バイオモートの保存に持ってこいだホームだと床ずれの心配がある逆に無重量だと臓器の機能が弱るまさに月は臓器保存に最適の地なんだ刈り取った商品は加工した後に月資源に混ぜてマスドライバーで送る加工臓器移植といってもさまざまなケースがある我々は必要な臓器を必要な状態に加工してすぐ移植できるようにしている高齢者や感染症を起こしているバイオト以外は全てここへ送られるじゃあなぜビクトルのような高齢者をふんバイオモートの利用方法は移植用臓器や血液の保存のみではない北条やビクトルのような高齢者のバイオモートは希少なホルモンなどの生産や新薬開発用の実験体として使われる若い女のバイオモートは人工子宮として子供を産むこともできるもう代理母の必要もない北条は特異的な血液型所有者なので血液の生産用に保存している全世界に臓器が不足している毎日のようにニュースではその話題だどうだね宇宙医学のために十分なっているだろライドお前も我々の臓器ネットワークの存在を知っていれば女房は助かったのになキャサリン宇宙開発とドラッグそして将来的なドナーの欠乏そこにいち早く目をつけたのが徳川だ奴はこのことを30年前に予測していた救世主サルバドール気取りだなサルバドール今から30年前ポリスノーツとしてビヨンドへ派遣された時徳川からこの計画を持ちかけられた徳川ゲイツそして私は徳川の財力とコネクションさらに BCP を操作してビヨンドに君臨する策略を練ったその長期にわたる計画にはエドとジョナサンお前らのような金と権力に欲のない道徳論者が邪魔だったまさかあの事故なんてことだ30年前のエンプスユーリーの暴走事故 I was wondering about how that accident tied into this. 徳川の命令で私が細工した事故後救助活動を遅らせるようにしたのはゲイツだあれが人為的な事故しかし貴様が生きていようとはしぶといやつだすでに我々の計画は成功しシステムは起動している今となってはお前らがどう叫ぼうとびくともせんが徳川を怒らせてしまったからな始末せねばならんサルバトーレイ
エドジョナサン悲しい顔をするなお前たちを見送った後すぐにでもお前たちの家族や仲間たちに会わしてやるあの世でなしまったマークやアナモンお前らプラトークレーターの語源を知ってるかギリシャ神話のプルトンそうプルトンとは止めるものの意味だがギリシャローマ神話のプルトンは冥界の神つまりあの世ビヨンドのな我々を象徴するにはぴったりの地名だそしてお前たちもこのバイオモートのようにここで眠ることになるこの死者と聖者とをつなぐこのプラトーの地でなくそエドビヨンドへ戻ろうそいつに頼ってもダメだそこの腰抜けは銃が撃てないんだはできんエンプスが来るここを脱出しようどうやってここを出る LSM は来ないぞいい考えがある聞きたくないこういう時のお前の思いつきはろくなことがなかったマスドライバーだあれに乗ってここを出るやっぱりなむちゃくちゃな考えだそれしか変える方法はないひとまずここを出て中央案内所まで戻ろうさあこっから脱出しようあっぼいあみじゅすとうくいくせいびせいびやあいかちゅぽんちゃっそればだでもそほどとたけんでんでんでんでんでんでんでんでんでんでんでんでんでんでんでんでんでんおいしいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいしゃいし Harmless people with a whole, whole load of gore or some or stuff. Maybe that's the game I'm thinking of. I, I, I might be misremembering. Just noticed a big continu continuity error from the front. He's holding the gun with one hand, but from the side, he's using both. Oh, I did not notice that. Maybe he was here.、Yeah. That is disgusting. Yeah, that was, that was pretty raw. Not gonna lie. Plato's Republic ruled by philosophers kings for those interested. Oh! Yeah, there's. Yeah. Not too upon Plato's works, but、uh, he was a pretty important figure in history, I think. The beeping means the self destruct sequence has been activated. It sure does. He's gonna blow up, unless we get out of here. And just don't use drugs used a lot in the early 80s and early 90s. Yeah, it's probably the one I'm thinking of. Like, you run around as a cop and. Just blow people up with kind of reckless abandon. Yeah. All right. Let's get the hell out of here. Well, let's make sure he's dead. Can we double tap him? Make sure he's dead. He's dead. t h e l l probably be the next one they put in here. Ugh. That garbage ain't worth the time. Maybe I disconnect these things? I suppose you could call them. There's no point staying any longer. We already know what's going on here. Let's go. 
I suppose we don't have time for that. He is not letting me. All right. Let's get out of here. Kyo-san, Kyo-tsukuro. Empus no cockpit ga tojiteru. Mazui. Holy crap, that hurt. <laughs> Good job I saved. That could have ended bad. <laughs> Knack led to a Smash TV and Total Carnage. Much better games. Oh, right, fair enough. Yeah, that didn't get very close. I was a little bit worried for a second. I was watching my health go down going, oh my god. Thank god I saved. Go to the... I'm Swiss cheese now. Yeah, a few parts of me hurt. We don't have to exactly look for it, it's right there. あれだ。あれがマスドライバーだ。あれを使って脱出しよう。ジョーさん、外へ出るぞ。分かった。よし、行くぞ。駆け足だぞ。いいな。6分の1G だ。俺もっとポリスノースだ。うまくやれるさ。火星の3分の1Gよりは楽だ。これがマスドライバー。ここから それじゃ俺たちはどうでもありすればいい。Oh my god. Where exactly is that thing pointing? That's the guideway, the mass driver's acceleration rail. What's controlling everything? Probably that building there. Let's go check it out. It ain't first class, but that's our only way off here. We need to head for the control tower. The edge of a cliff. It's about as deep as uh, the, the Grand Canyon. You wouldn't want to fall down there. No. Even if the gravity is only one sixth of homes. Look at all that black. Total emptiness. It's a long, long way between stars and planets. Most of space is as exciting as a rest stop. Let's face it, this is the true nature of outer space. Basically, it's a launch way to break the moon's gravity. Would save a ton of fuel. Yep, it's yeah, just basically one big uh, yeah, catapult, as they say. Doesn't take much out here for people to lose it. Salvatore was right about that. All the darkness makes you realize how much we take home for granted. Looking out from here, it feels like everything revolves around the moon, doesn't it? Yeah, we've always been self-centered that way. Space, pitch black. Not a nice feeling. Nope. Nope. Buckets carrying mineral minerals are being launched along the guideway. That's the handrail for the stairs. Better hold on as you're going up. Don't worry, I saw the drop. Don't try anything stupid here, all right? I know what you're like. That's the mass driver's control tower. We can get in one of the pods from there. Mm -hmm. 
なんで月面に BGP でしか許可されていないオーダーとバタがいるんだトップガーは鉛筆の質素体を持ってるに違いないなんてこったえっと反動がある体を押さえてくれジョナサン頼むぞエド、本当に大丈夫だろうな。Pretend you're on a big roller coaster. Ah, <laughs> launched into space. You want to save? Sure. <laughs> Caddy, you missed a very good chance for a quote earlier on. <laughs> Not gonna lie. X6. ようやくたどり着いたなあれから6日は経つみんな無事だろうか至急カレンに月でのバーチャルレコーダー映像とセンサーデータのリンクを頼もう BBC のバーチャル編集機を使えればいいんだが見張りはいないようだ入ろうパパ大変よマークがマークがマークがどうしたデカチョ見てこれが今朝家にクソやつらマークをなんてこったパパマークはどうなるの AMM は30周年記念のイベントでごった返してるわよやつら俺たちを AMM へ呼び寄せて
法的に射殺するつもりだな今出て行ったら危険よ彼らの思うつぼだわ俺一人で行く奴らマークに何かしてみろただでは済まん落ち着けエド俺たちが揃って出て行けばマークも助からんじゃあどうするんだいい手があるわ何テレビを使うの<音楽>なるほどテレビ中継者とはな。AMM にも何台か回していたのを思い出したの AMM 内の数箇所にカメラをセッティングしてあるわこれだと外に出なくても監視できるでしょ AMM のほとんどの場所はカバーできるはずああそれにこの無線があればなエド聞こえるか聞こえるぞジョナサンメリル聞こえるか奴らを見かけたかいえまだ見てないわでも私服だとわからないわよすぐわかるさ奴ら顔色がない顔色ねそうだカレンさん気分はどう大丈夫平気よちょっとは良くなったわ具合悪いのかジョナサンたちが月に行ってる間に一度倒れて入院したのよ大変だったんだからえっ本当なのかいつものことよ気にしてたら何もできないわ私のことより今はマークちゃんのことよああそうだなジョナサンいたかエド少しは落ち着けよ分かってるマークを見つけたらすぐ教えてくれマークはマークは俺の息子だ分かってる俺はエドしっかりしろああ時間はいくらでもあるけど結論を急ぐな。みんな冷静にな。わかった、ジョナサン。俺は月面コーナーを見張る。エドは月には詳しいからな。バカいい。私はロビーへ行くわ。じゃあ。ジョナサン、それじゃあ、このモニターの使い方を説明するわね。AMM 内には合計8台のカメラがセットされているのこのテレビ中継車には中継モニターが4つしかないから同時に4箇所しか見られないそれで ?1 台のモニターが2台のカメラから送られてくる映像を掛け持ちしてるわけだからカメラを切り替える時はモニターの上にあるカメラのボタン番号を押せばいいわ見たいカメラナンバーを押すとそのカメラからの映像がモニターに出るわ簡単でしょ左上のモニターはロビーに置いてある1番2番のカメラを右上のモニターはビヨンドコーナーに置いてある3番4番のカメラを左下のモニターは月面コーナーに置いてある5番6番のカメラを右下のモニターは探査コーナーに置いてある7番8番のカメラをそれぞれ映しているわ。映像の違いはそれぞれ偶数のカメラはロングの映像を映しているわ無線はどうやって使うエドかメリルさんの映っている画面をクリックすればいいわわかったじゃあ始めましょう GOLPOK Give it a go. Hi, Meryl. Oh, hydrate. Oh, thank you. Mmm. Thank you. Meryl's patrolling the lobby. Nothing to report right now. I haven't noticed anyone suspicious come in. Unusual at the lobby. It's unusual at the Beyond Corner. It's a 
Wide shot of the beyond corner. Moon corner looks fine. Hey, Ed. It's patrolling the moon corner. I don't see anything unusual. Nope. Juna san, beyond the corner, the monitor has disappeared. What? Huh? Let's find the space corner. Is there a problem on our end? One of you needs to go check that out. Meryl, beyond the corner, the monitor is weird. Check it out. I understand. Sort of corral hole. Nothing wrong here. Oh, good job, Meryl. Meryl, what happened? Jonathan, someone was holding a camera. A camera? It's a bad thing. It's a bad thing. Meryl, go back to the hotel. Okay, I'll go back. Don't worry. I'll remember when I'm holding a camera. Seems fine at Space Corner. everywhere Everything looks normal Camera ni hankachi ga kakete yatta sou da Hankachi Kodomo no itazara daro ka Edo chuui shite kude yo I don't see anyone who looks like Mark. Seeing anything on your end? I'm keeping my eyes open. I'm, I'm, I'm trying. Hey, who's that? Definitely him. Oh God, Meryl's in the area. Meryl, come in Meryl. We have a situation. Ed, get over there. Edo, it is up. Go there. Beyond the corner. Maybe the train is coming. Edo. And he's gone. Disappeared from the camera's field of view. Hurry up, Ed. We're going to lose him. Who's 
use that? Nope, not important. There. Ed, you're a bit slow there, buddy. Where is he, Jonathan? I lost him. You don't see him anywhere? Nope, can't see him. He should be around there somewhere. Okay, well, I'll keep looking. place money on him he, oh, one of these cameras he's just directly staring at us <laughs> yeah hi Meryl <laughs> Meryl, Ed, get over there now. Meryl, Mark, you are found. The robot man is in the room. Come on, Meryl. Robot. Where? Two can't see. I know. Well, I would, but he's now gone from the lobby. Oh. He isn't here, Jonathan. Oh my god, he's giving us the run round here. Oh my god. The situation keeps getting worse. Chris, Edo, what's going on? 
手術はうまくいったみたいでも意識が戻らないのしばらくこの ICU で様子を見ないとねパパデカチョウできるだけのことはやってみるわあとは祈るしかないクリスエドが良くなるまでエドが入院してることは内密に頼む担当医やナースにも漏らさないように言ってくれ分かってるわ患者の命を守るのが医者の務めよジョナサンパパ大丈夫よねアナごめんなさい私がそばにいながらいやアナ俺がエドをこの事件に巻き込んだエドは嫌がってたんだ違うわジョナサンパパいつもジョナサンのこと言ってたジョナサンが帰ってきてくれたって生き生きしてたあんなパパ見るの母さんが死んでから初めてエドがそんなことを私パパにうんと長く生きてもらいたいこれまで私パパに苦労ばかりかけてきたものパパ私のこと気にして再婚もせずに LS のバッグの時だって私無茶な注文してパパを困らせたあのあれは私知ってるわジョナさんでも私嬉しかったそんなに私のこと気遣ってくれるなんて私はパパから本物の愛情をもらったものアナちゃんマークちゃんパパは心配ないわ私たちがきっと元気にしてみせるわリリルあなたちを頼む彼の容体を見てくるどうですかカレンはやっと落ち着いたところですカレンさんの親族の方ですかいや知り合いです彼女とても危険な状態ですこんなに無理をしてあれほど安静にしていなければいけないって忠告してたんですがそうだったんですか私はカレンさんの主治医コリンズですこれまでカレンさんの治療を担当してきましたあなたどこかでお会いしましたかいや人違いじゃないですかまあどうでもいいことですがねジョナサン・イングラムさんえ大丈夫です警察には言いません心配しないでくださいあのニュースが本当か嘘かなんてあなたやカレンさんを見ればわかりますあなたは俺を信じるんですか医者というものは本来体のことだけではなく心の中までも診察できなければねありがとう先生感謝するのならゴドウィン理事長にしなさい我々は彼女に従っているだけですそれよりも彼女の容態が心配ですああボーイ<笑>カレン The skin doesn't look good. It's so pale. Her anemia is quite severe. She has bruises too. Those are caused by her platelet count being so low. Show me your eyes again. She's under anesthesia right now, Mr. Ingram. Okay, well, let's get the obvious one out of the way again, because it's Jonathan. She must be in a lot of pain. Karen, feel free to ask me any questions you have about her condition. I'm sorry, but can you not touch her? Please just let her rest. Okay, thank you. The game does have some restraint here. <laughs> I'm glad. I'm recording data on Karen's condition. She's been this way since yesterday. Bounce, bounce, followed instantly by Dirk Regret. You're absolutely right. If it was to go bounce, bounce, then I would be maybe disgusted a little bit. <laughs> like, she's in the hospital. Don't do this, Kojima and pals. Please, 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 for me. And they didn't, so thank you. 
It's all numbers and medical terms, so I don't know if they make much sense. Doubt you'd understand what this all this information means. This equipment displays various data on Karen. I'm sure even and, and Jim Brioche isn't that messed up. Hmm? Guess it's all up to this doctor. I understand your concerns. That uncertainty of not knowing what course she'll take. This must be the real Dr. Collins. Doesn't seem like a hitman sent by Tokugawa or anything. Judge from his ID, he's real. I can assure you I'm a doctor here. Get information on a vital signs from this she's in critical condition yeah I uh, I'm ignorant on this I don't know what symptoms you go through when you need a bone marrow transplant I understand that they're obviously real things but uh, I'm not familiar with the symptoms but I'm guessing it isn't very good is it okay if we talk it's painful from what I heard. Mm. Don't know if random collapsing is also a part of it. It probably is. I, I don't really know. What would you like to know? Ask about. She has aplastic anemia. Basically, there's an abnormality in her bone marrow's hemato. Oh goodness. Hemato poetic. Hematopoietic stem cells, the cells that create new blood cells, and they aren't able to produce blood correctly anymore. In her case, the cause is exposure to cosmic rays. Please save Karen. We'll do everything in our power. We almost thought she wouldn't make it for a while there. She's suffering from... Oh, she's suffering from appendicitis? Okay. As well as several other infections because her immune system is virtually non-functioning. Her hemorrhaging hasn't stopped. She's very anemic. That's why her face is so pale. We finished working on her appendicitis with a blood platelet transfusion and high doses of antibiotics, but she won't survive like this much longer. Yes, as somebody who was rushed to hospital with the very, very, very quick need of having their appendix removed, I definitely know what appendicitis is. Karen was saying a transplant is the only way to treat her, is that right? In her case, the only remaining option is a bone marrow transplant. And if we don't do it soon, it'll be too late. Give the patient radiation therapy before the actual transplant. If the patient isn't sufficiently strong enough for that, the prognosis generally isn't good. The only thing medical science can do for her is a bone marrow transplant. Cures a mega drive and <laughs> dynamite heady. Absolutely. Beat Spinderella first try. Go on. I dare you. Karen was telling me about it. It's a complex procedure, isn't it? You can think of it as a similar to a blood transfusion. We take bone marrow stem cells from a donor and transplant them into the patient's carotid, carotid artery. The operation takes about an hour. That's the easy part, relatively speaking. Before the transplant, we kill off all the recipient's bone marrow stem cells and white blood cells. We give them large doses of chemotherapy and expose their entire body to 7.5 gray of radiation. It's not as dangerous as it sounds, generally speaking anyway. The problem is finding a donor with the matching HLA type. 7.5 grays of radiation? That's how you measure radiation in grays? Hmm. Never to say you don't really maybe learn anything from a Kojima game. You, you, you pick up some stuff. He's very much into researching his stuff when he when he does this kind of stuff, isn't he? Which I suppose you have to be if you want to be accurate. Also, 
The art in this is absolutely fantastic. I don't really know much about visual novels on the Saturn because we sure as hell didn't get any, any here. But the art for this game seems quite exceptional. I don't know if it's the rule. Maybe Zap, you might be able to tell me if this is an exception rather than, oh, they've all got good art like this or something like that. But this seems very standout. It is a damn shame we didn't get this here in the rest of the world. Bone marrow transplants began in the 1970s, almost 70 years ago now. The transplant itself is fairly straightforward. The possibility of the immune system rejecting the new cells afterward is the problem. We need a donor whose HLA type matches Karen's. I keep hearing about... I, I was literally just about to ask this. I keep hearing about HLA type. What exactly is that? Apparently the art and animation for this is very good for the genre. Oh! Fair enough. Because I've seen Matchy. I've watched you played Matchy and it's essentially still pictures of real life. It's not a, of a style like this, so that's why I ask. A transplant science... As transplant science advanced, it was discovered that the primary cause of rejections had to do with the lymphocytes, a type of white blood cell. I know lymphocytes because that was mentioned in Snatcher. Not sure what I have to ask at work to learn about that. Hmm. Specifically, one human's leukocyte antigen or HLA type. In other words, if the HLA types match, chances of a transplant being successful go up. So if the types don't match, you can't perform the transplant? That's correct. I'm putting money on it. I'm putting money on it here and now. Jonathan has the same HLA type as Karen. Betcha. What are the chances of finding a H ah! HLA match? HLA types are genetically determined, so the odds of finding a match between nod blood relatives are extremely low. The rate of interracial and inter-ethnic matches is almost zero. Children inherit their HLA type as a combination of their parents' as HLA types. Highest rate of success is between siblings, where there is a one in four chance they'll share the same H HLA type. Holy crap. Yeah, because you don't want to waste the organ and tissue. HLA stands for Half Life, <laughs> Half -Life Alex. Of course, it does. That was the key to it all. This is Half Life 3 we're playing. And just to be on the safe side, there also needs to be a match between minor histocompatibility antigens. If both of these match, the success rate of bone marrow transplants is about 70%. Holy crap, bone marrow transplant is a lot more complicated than I thought. I don't even know what bone marrow looks like. I don't even know how you transplant it. I don't even know how you get it out from one person to the other. It's They probably explained it here, but I'm just trying to visualize it in my head. It's like, how do you do that? Like, a bone marrow is inside a bone. Do you have to drill into a bone, take out the marrow, and then drill into her bone and put the marrow in? I don't... I don't know. So, the donor of the HLA donor was found. I searched beyond the Kotsui Bank, but there was no one in the room. But... But... This is an unfortunate thing. Beyond the data of the HLA, カレンさんのHLAが他に適用するドナーが一人いました。ゲイツ・ベッカーという人物です。ゲイツ？なんて皮肉だ。知り合いですか？その人物に問い合わせをしたんですが、我々の要請に答えてくれないんです。ゲイ
gates. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think he's going to be quite cooperative with us, is he? Oh, I, I got it right. That's how you get bone marrow. Okay, fair enough. So it's about the immune system. Yup, because you don't want to waste... Oh, sorry. I already read that. Uh, yes. Oh, it's horrendously ex expensive to perform and horrendously painful. Oh, God. <sighs> right, okay. That's why it's so painful. Okay. Gotcha. Is there no other way? Unfortunately, no. The only thing that can save Karen is a bone marrow transplant. Normally, it is possible to use a psych physiologically active substance such as inter interleukin-3 to increase patient stem cell count temporarily. But this wouldn't have any effect in Karen's case. The method is still used in peripheral blood stem cell transplantation. It was developed in order to lessen the burden on the donor. So a transplant is the only option? Yes. Only a bone marrow transplant will save her. And the only person who matches her HLA type is Gates Becker. If you do, in fact, know him, please try to convince him. We can't force anyone to participate in a transplant. That's <laughs> すぐ終わります。この血液を用意している抗体を使って、HLA の番号を調べるだけです。HLA型の検査は約5時間ほどで終わります。実際に骨髄を抜くときは少しつらい思いをしますがね。え? <笑> ジョナサ。ジョナサ。マークが星の絵を描いてくれたの。これがそうよ。この左側のバイクスーツの男はレッドウッドだわ。右側が宇宙服の男か。ん?これは。この花の絵は何だろう。それも私も気になって、あの時現場には花なんてなかったもの。花か。何の花だろう。もしかしてそれ
ジョナサン分かったのね誰なのこの宇宙服の男はジョナサンガソルでその人物を刺してみてさあ、uh, I do? Oh my goodness. Uh... Oh boy, gotta think here. Sorry, catch up on chat as well. Wouldn't surprise me if they found a different way to perform it by the time this game takes place. Yeah, that's true. When is the set? 2047? Quite possibly. Unfortunately, science on that has improved much even today. Oh, right. Mm. Also, I have to say, I love this early anime art style, which is my favorite. It is nice. I'll give it that. It's definitely uh, distinctive. It's a cool look for the game. I like it. Um, click on the person, I think. Who I think was in the spacesuit. Wait, and also likes lavender. Chris? No way, it couldn't be Chris, could it? Try it. It's them. いつもラベンダーの香水つけてたものまさかあのクリスさんがでもこの頃にで香水つけてる人なんて他にいないわしまったどうして気がつかなかったんだマークは知ってたのねそれでまずいわ彼女デカ長の病室よアナマーク危ないからここにいろ俺はエドの病室へ行くクリスよせエドを殺すつもりかいや来ないでジョナサンクリスどうして来ないでそれ以上近づかないで飛び降りるわよどうしてなんだ私こうするしか仕方なかったのよ誰に頼まれた徳川よ江戸をバイオモートにごめんなさいそれじゃあ石田に代わって AMM におびき寄せたあの電話もクリスあんただなあなたみたいなよそ者にはわからないわビヨンドで生きていくには宇宙で生きていくには徳川に身も心も売るしかなかったここでは誰も徳川に逆らえないわ両親に先立たれ残ったのは多額の負債とこの病院だけこんな大病院何とかやっていくには徳川に取り入ってこびるしかなかった私は人として生きることを捨てたの女の幸せもクリスそれに私の息子のためにも息子だってあなたも見たでしょ理事長室の写真あの子供の写真かモデル生命が危うくなったあの頃私はもう一度マスコミの注目を浴びようと必死になっていたのお金と政府の援助が欲しかったからそれで当時ビヨンドでも問題になっていたフローズナーの代理母にフローズナーまさかそれがデッドウッドそうよ彼は私が産んだ、oh、でもあの出産時の感染事故で私は二度と子供を産めない体にあの子が最初で最後の子供
しかし奴は政府所有のフローズだええトニーは政府に取り上げられたわ何度も裁判したけどあの子は取り戻せなかった私に母親の権利は認められないって徳川のそばにいればトニーのそばにいれる私息子のそばにいたかったそのために人も殺すのかもう止められないのよ私落ちるとこまでクリスまだやり直せる徳川や芸術の悪行をこのビヨンドにはびこる悪を法廷で証言してくれ今のままじゃあんたもバイオモードと変わらない受け入れるだけじゃなく自分から行動するんだ生きるってのはそういうことだろう。できないわ私には人の命を救うのが医者だって言ったじゃないかピヨンとの病気を人類の病気を治してくれクリス奴らに関して知ってることを全部証言してくれお願いだ私にそんなことできるビヨンドの病気を治すなんてあんたならできる私はクリス分かったわジョナサン全て話すわ何もかも死ぬのは貴様の方だがな江戸と一緒に臓器となって人様の役に立て待ってるぞジョナサンまだ意識が戻らないジョナサン AP やエンプスが徳川ビルに集結してるらしいわそうだ俺を待ってる味方は一人もいないわここではゲイツや徳川に逆らえない BCP の仲間に呼びかけたんだけど仕方ないみんな知らんふりしてるわ相手が悪いってジョナサンビヨンドを出るしかないわ無理だカレンやエドは動かせんダメよ黙って殺されるつもり誰も助けてくれないわこれまで俺は人生を逃げてきたロレインのことも何言ってるのやり残したことがあるロレインとの約束ジョナサン勝ち目はないわ奴らを許せん同じポリスノーツとしてバカよポリスノーツなんてもう過去の遺物じゃないポリスノーツは俺の人生にとっては誇りなんだそれにカレンを救うにはゲイツの骨髄が必要なんだそれが罠よジョナサン落ち着いてもう俺は冷静になれない俺は戦うそう
分かったわ私も手伝うわジョナサン病院での留守番は苦手なのメリル預かってほしいものがある嫌よ形見なんてタバコだタバコこれまでの自分を君に預けておく分かったわありがとう Mm-hmm. <laughs> Wherever you look, this is where all of Beyond's problems come from. This building. I'll tear down this goddamn pile of shit myself if I have to. The people here deserve better. There's no telling how much blood is on their hands. You've got obligatory gaming logic. Even in a world with such attention to detail and scientific explanations. Mm hmm. I think we might be getting close to the end. I know you're in there, Sadoki. I'm coming for you, fuckface. <laughs> in some ways, I'm glad I'm not playing the censored version. I believe the PlayStation version was censored, but the Saturn version was not. Jonathan. This is not easy with the deep pad. <laughs> Oh, 
手厚い歓迎だなこの先が大変だ Oh, oh boy, okay. That's about to get some new management. An ad for Tokugawa Space Hotel. Today is the end of your bullshit propaganda. Now's not the time to hang around here, they'll be in the garden. Time for a new chapter in the family history. I gotta hurry to the garden. Okay. It's his moon base. Thinks he can build his shit wherever he wants. Doesn't look like there's anyone else. I just about throw up every time I see this. Elevator goes straight to the garden. It's a window. Gives you a view of the entire colony. Now for the Tokugawa Moon Tour. Maybe this is where Ed got his idea. This is what we used to work it before. That's the floor number display. The garden was the 40th floor. And this is not showing anything. Alright, floor 40, I guess. To the garden. Izo, Isoge, or Yasra and Tokore. Oh god. I couldn't climb outside at this height. It's no good, the panel short circuited. And it's totally dead. Well let me go up or down. Can't use any of the buttons. Uh monitor? Oh, this isn't showing anything. Place says we've stopped at the 20th floor. What about that? Can you do anything with that? Nope. Move, get off. Yes. Uh, the, the how? There's an elevator. Here. Oh joy, you can force the doors open usually, I suppose. I didn't think there were any flaws, uh, but... Okay, no, oh. no, no, never mind. This is the 20th floor, just like the elevator said. 20 more to the garden. Security monitors for the garage, they're not showing anything. It's a van, doesn't look like anyone's inside. Kaze is secured to the ground with magnets in the floor. Interesting. It's a compact car. No one's in it. Oi, 
ジョナサンどうだ怖いだろレッドウッドだなああゲイツはどこだ本部署は40階のガーデンでお前を待ってるだがお前はそこまでたどり着けまいお前はこのエンプスの性能を分かっちゃいないなら教えてもらおうかなかなか物分かりがいい楽しもうぜジョンさんこんなゲームはめったにないなんだとわかったかジョナサン生きるか死ぬかではない何分で死ぬか頼むから簡単には死ぬまよ行くぞポリスノーツエンプスを破棄したかクラッチ again, you're not kidding <laughs> Nick, ha, I threw a truck to show my power Yeah, he didn't chuck that red car at me I was expecting him to do that at some point It's like, like he's hiding in there It's Redwood Emps He's not inside it He really has abandoned it I wouldn't think an Emps should become inoperable this easy. Also, Mick, Mother Trucker, I need more cover. <laughs> I guess he knows when it's time to move on. Or maybe he just wants a man to man fight. Not getting away this time, Redwood. As long as it takes you, hear me? As long as it fucking takes. He's bleeding milk. Redwood's blood, he's bleeding again. Oh, good. That will means we'll be able to follow him. Blood here too. These are the emergency stairs. Looks like he escaped up there. They extend upward in a spiral. Yes. Obikyo said it's more than Lasen Kaida. Yatsa Wika. Oh boy, this looks like the perfect shooting gallery. Spiral staircase. Should I have a lot of stairs here? I'm seeing from here. Damn it, I can't see anything from down here. Ow.
め上のフロアに逃げたなギャッよし三十回上がるぞ Wait Are we going down or up? Oh やつめどこへ隠れた I thought that said 13th floor. Never mind, I can't read. This is Redwoods, you must be here somewhere. Only ten more till the garden. This blood leads to the back. There isn't a single car here, meaning the only place for him to hide is behind one of the pillars. It also means he can see me perfectly from wherever he is. The only blood I can see is that trail on the left. Jonah, sir, can you hear me? Edo's condition is how? I didn't shoot him. Oh, you're not going to shoot him. You're not going to shoot him. 俺にとっちゃリドリーのことなんかどうでもいいのになやはり敵を取るつもりじゃなかったんだな敵笑わせるな俺は自分のためにしか行動しない誰が死のうと関係ないあれは芝居だ江戸をいたぶるためのな何だと俺に復讐心があるとすればむしろ貴様に対してだチョナさん、俺をここまでハイにしてくれたのは貴様が最初で最後だ。デッドウッド、どこだ？姿を見せろ。ここにいる。腎臓は俺がもらったなかなか健康な腎臓だよもともとあいつに打たれてダメになったこれがいただいても文句はなんだろうレッドウッドキどうだ俺を倒せる自信がなくなってきただろうクローズナーは無事になるジョナサン俺を黙らせたらどうだできないのかHe's behind that pillar. Oh, he's not on this floor anymore. He's behind any of the pillars. He ran up the stairs. More stairs, huh? Looks like he went up here. There's light above the emergency exit. It says exit on it. I'm glad it does. Yes. やつめ、弱ってきたな Bastard. 
工場も北条のワイフもデイブもビクトルも皆<笑>俺がやった<笑>悔しいかこれが憎いだろう殺したいだろうレッドウッドお前の殺したクリスは俺の母親だって言いたいのか<笑>知ってる<笑>誰も俺を殺すことはできないのさジョナサン・イングラム残るはゲイツ徳川。ッハリソン・フォード・ロボットス。ハリソン・フォード・ロボットス。ハリソン・フォード・ロボットス。ハリソン・フォード・ロボットス。ハリソン・フォード・ロボットス。ハリソン・やつらのいるガーデンへ急ごう。よく来たな、ジョナサンイングラム。どこだ。ここだ。ここにいる徳川はここにはいないお前の相手は私で十分だ軍用エンプスか年を取ると厚着したくなるらしい何まだ分からぬと見えるジョナサンお前のような古い人間の時代は終わったのださあ撃ってみろほら私が憎いのだろう撃ってみろさあ撃っていい私を殺してみろおおかわざしてみろおかわざしてみろおかわざしてみろおかわざしてみろおかわざし何のためにここまでおびき寄せたと思うジョナサンでは私の番だな遠慮なく行くぞあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあジョナサン、急所は外した三十代の若い臓器は高く売れる傷つけては徳川に申し訳ないケイツさんジョナサン貴様らは宇宙開発のほんの表面しか見ていない人類が大気圏外で生活するという波大抵のことではないんだ宇宙は我々にはあまりにも否定的すぎる神は我々に宇宙へ出ていくだけの肉体を与えてはくれなかった我々は48億年の時をかけて進化してきただが我々の科学は人類の進化スピードを追い越してしまった我々は宇宙へ出るにはまだ早すぎる種だったのにな。それと、麻薬、臓器密売とどういう関係がある宇宙時代の黎明期、人類は宇宙環境という大きな
壁にぶち当たった二十世が終わりからすでに理論上の宇宙コロニー建造は可能だったしかし問題は我々人間の側にあった。過酷な宇宙環境それによる人類の精神や肉体臓器遺伝子へのさまざまな悪影響21世紀の半ばに入ってなお大規模な一般コロニーがこのビヨンドのみにとどまっていることで想像ができよう結局我々はホームを離れては生きていけるあらゆる生命活動は地球の重力に支配されているのだビヨンドでは太陽風や宇宙船による放射線被爆の影響で肉体に何らかの疾患を持って生まれてくる子どもたちの数が年々急増しているこれまでの宇宙開発は放射線に関してあまりにも無防備すぎた。そして肉体だけではなく人の心にも宇宙は冷酷だ無重量によるカルシウムや窒素の喪失放射線問題はいずれ技術的に解決できるかもしれんしかし精神への影響は今のところ何の手立てもない今やポリスノーツの時代ではない誰もが宇宙へ行ける潜在的な精神障害の発生長期間閉鎖拘束されることから来る妄想幻想そして逃れることのできない孤独十分に訓練された者たちでも耐え難い苦痛だ宇宙は第二の故郷とはなりえない宇宙は実理的利用や科学的研究のための場でしかない我々全員がこの環境に適応を進出することは過去の絵空事だこれが今世紀の初めに科学者たちが出した結論だった「その大きな壁をぶち破った」とでも言うのか貴様のような保守的な人間が宇宙開発を語る資格はない。人類には麻薬と臓器のスペアが必要なのだ私は徳川と組み奴の財力とコネクションを使いこの宇宙開発の矛盾を克服したここまで来るのに30年もかかった30年だぞこれからますます人類は宇宙へと出ていくそうなればさらに過酷な環境と問題に直面するだろう今に我々のとった決断と行動が賛美される時代が来るだろう徳川も私も神が知忘れたことを代行しているだけだゲイツお前は神なんかじゃない徳川に飼われている哀れな犬だ犬だと飼い主も飼えるところもない野良犬が何を言ういいかこのシステムは昨日や今日の思いつきではない30年前ポリスノーツとしてこのビヨンドに派遣された時から慎重に築き上げてきたものだ全てはうまくいっていたのだそれはあの臆病者が北条が規律を乱した北条が何をした奴は DDS の仕事から手を引こうとした年寄りのわがままだそれで徳川は北条に雑木密売の話を教えてやったんだ
娘を正規の骨髄バンクでは救えんが徳川のルートなら可能性があるとなだが北条は怖くなった我々に逆らうとはもってのほかだしかしあの北条の妻がジョナサン貴様の前妻だったとはな許さんゲイスベッカー許さん許しを請うのは貴様の方だ分かった臓器だけでもともったが跡形もなく始末してやろう私の貴重な演説を貴様一人に聞かせるのはもったいなかったがな<笑>まあいいだろうジョナサン覚悟しろ覚悟するのはお前の方だゲイツ気でも凍ったかそこのテレビを見てみろ希望通りお前の演説を全世界の人たちが聞いているゲイツお前も身の破滅だなメリルうまく取れてるかはあ、ジョナサンざまわないけどよく言ってるわなんだどういうことだなんだどういうことだなんだどういうことだなんだどういうことだこ、これはおぬい貴様ら生かしておかん死ねえジョナサン警官したい。わお。止まれ<笑>私を舐めるなと言っただろう徳川放送局は我々が抑えたこれが最後だ諦めろジョナサンやれ動かないで来てくれたわあんたら見直したよあんたらは本物のポリスノーツだバカな何のつもりだあんたももう終わりよこのビルの周りは警官隊とマスコミが取り囲んでいるわデカチョ<笑>いいですかジョナサンあなたの骨髄でカレンさんは助かります頑張ってくださいわお、オッケーウィスティルゴインウィスティルゴインウィスティルゴインウィスティルゴイおインサートディスク1オーライトビューセイソーゲームオ
昨夜徳川グループ三代目現徳川グループ総裁のジョゼフ・サダオキ徳川がナーク麻薬および臓器密売殺人教唆の容疑で検察庁に送検されましたなお爆発のあった徳川ビルプロップは現在ご覧のように折れ曲がっていますが調査当局によりますと崩壊の心配はないとのことですビヨンドへの影響もありません付近住民への避難勧告も解除されましたまるでこの支柱は今回の徳川グループを象徴するようですこの事件によりこれからの宇宙開発に大きな問題提起がなされたことになります CM に引き続き BBC ではこの事件の報道特番をお送りいたしますこれから忙しくなるなエド定年はお預けだが無理はするなよああ気のいいところを見計らってやめればいいさジョーさんんいやいいんだこれカレンから預かったものだ機内で開けてくれそうかエド俺もお前に渡すものがあるんだなんだこれさ見てみろよここれはマークがああ俺の顔俺のエドもう大丈夫だよマークはお前を理解してるジョナサンありがとうありがとうエドエド話してくれないかじゃあなエド元気だなジョナサンいやここに俺の居場所はない行くよエドそうかジョナサンジョナサン俺たちはいいパートナーだったよなあ,あ最高の友達さママに叱られるわよ I think it might have been implied that Jonathan ah, Jonathan provided a little bit of bone marrow at the end there. You had no idea that tomb was from police notes. <laughs> yeah, not many people do, I guess, because they didn't get this in the West. Damn shame. 
I think this probably could have done quite well if it actually came out in the rest of the world, but that ain't gonna happen. That was a very good story. <laughs> Research Hideo Kojima. That's not a surprise. <laughs> And also props to the translation team. They did this entirely for free just because they could. Good job, guys. Thank you for giving us what Konami wouldn't. Going into it, I was expecting it to be related to Snatcher. Not really. But still, like I say, a fun little story in and of itself. Most funny, if I asked at work, I could get some very dry but informative medical books. I'm just afraid they would throw them at me. They are quite big. Ooh, could you knock a person out with one of them books? Easily. Mm. Interested. Are the old medical books, are they in Danish or English? Or both? Just curious. Most in English, right. And she was wearing she was wearing Dave's goggles at the end. That was cute. Right, we've been going oh wow, almost five hours. Nice. Good time to wrap up actually. I let the credit credits play out, of course, because look at all the nice people that made this game. Lots of people involved. There always is. Interactive CG stuff was quite quite impressive, I thought. Well, it took a lot of people to make it too. <laughs> oh, and there's a breast bouncing credit. Well that just sums it up, doesn't it? Three people worked on the breast bouncing. I'm sure they're very proud. I bet that's on one, at least one of their CV. What did you do on Police Knots? I worked on the breast bouncing. You're hired. God bless the boob team. <laughs> yes, like Kojima and Sato and Kojima and Kojima, yeah. <laughs> It's a bit like how I felt on System Shock, to be totally honest with you.
and I will probably be spending the rest of tonight making sure that the next game I want to play works on stream. Oh, here we go. English localization. Wait a minute. What? Mark Laidlaw did the translation for this? What? Okay. Cool. Good stuff. Are we staying on this page? A button, B button, C button, start button. Start button does nothing. I think we might be stuck here. This is the really long scene where they really want you know to say, hey, this game was developed and published by Konami Co. Limited. Don't you guys forget it. Anything? No? Let's try X button? No. Y button? No. Z button? Definitely not. Or, oh, there we go. Yep, they really wanted us to know. Well, that rounds things off quite nicely, actually. Thank you very much for hanging out. Hope everybody enjoyed Police Knots. If you've never seen that game before or played it, I hope that was entertaining. I certainly enjoyed it. Not quite as interesting as Snatcher, I would say, but a very enjoyable story nonetheless. No problem, Wolfenbach. No problem. All right. Let me have a look. Let's see who I can pass you off to. I will be streaming tomorrow. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for the bits, Wolfenbach. Yes, thank you for the 5,500 bits. You are absolutely mad but I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Let's get off this screen here. Um, what, what music can I leave you playing out on? Oh, wait a minute. That's new. What's this? Bonus features? Let's have a quick sneaky look, shall we? Oh, there's extra stuff here. All right. Okay. Stream's not over yet. We're having a look at the stuff. 
1994 Tokyo Toy Show trailer, 95 Tokyo Toy Show trailer, CG process, animation process. Ah, all right, let's have a little look. そこには信じられない秘密が隠されていた。この疑似世界を我々人間が作ったんだ。この希薄な宇宙空間に。Pilot disc. I guess they mean demo. That was interesting. Wait, wait a minute. This game came out for the three DO. What the hell? I didn't know that. Huh. Wait, Gundam 0083. Yeah, I did see that. Saw Hijami. Katoki reference there. Oh, well, well, fair enough. If you know them, you know them. I did not know this game came out on the 3DO. Probably Japan only, I guess. Right, what? Uh, that was a really interesting look at the uh, beginning of the game. Well, early version of the game, I should say. Let's see what changed between 94 and 95.天と地が一つに見えるところ。ここは本当のあの世、ビヨンドかもしれん。この疑似世界を我々人間が作ったんだ。この希薄な宇宙空間に人類の生命力は種の進化を超えているかもしれん。
俺の人生にとっては誇りなんだ28年間私だわ相棒。Nice. Oh, he worked on the game. He did the mech designs. Yeah, I guess so. He's a big name within the mecha anime genre, right? I guess,、uh, yeah, if you recognize his name right off the bat, then it、uh, must be pretty important. CG process. I was going to say, no wonder disc one was quite short. I guess they had to store all the data for these trailers and all things. So, all right, okay. Depending on how long these three videos are. Ah, interesting. So that wasn't hand drawn, that was CG. Okay. Can barely see that one due to the compression. <laughs> Yeah, those are always fun to watch. Cool seeing the thing, those things come together. We've got an interview. All right. Kikuko Inoue. What have you got to say for yourself, sir or madam? Oh my god. <laughs> okay. That's a lot of videos. <laughs> やっぱり映画の中での宇宙っていうかいろんな映画を小さい時から見てきて「あの未知との遭遇」とか「あの2001年宇宙の旅」とかあのそういう映画が私もワクワクしながら見てたんですけど自分自身としては今でも絶対に宇宙そしてあの宇宙人っていうんですか宇宙人の存在とか信じているんであのいつか会えたらいいなって。
ってるんです私の知り合いの人でねやっぱり UFO を見た人がいるとかあのいるんですけどそういう方が私もどうすれば見れるのかなってあの思いながらちょっと心の中で念じたりしてるんですけどまだなんか修行が足りないのか見たことないんですいつの日か見たいなと思っています。Maybe English subtitles. I think the translation team also did all this. I think it wouldn't be maybe right to not have these translated because people would then watch them after finishing the game going, What are they saying? I want to know. So, this is the first thing I've seen in the world. ラブロマンスとかあと家族ものと子供ものに弱いですねあの子供ものの映画を見るとついついほろっときてしまうっていうかあのすごくそのまあ映画の中の物語なんですけどもすごく胸に来てしまうっていうかジーンとする場面が好き例えばあのマイガールとか。あと4人の男の子が出てくる何でしたっけあ、スタンドバイミーですねああいうのがとっても好きです What we're all really interested in is What's your thought on video games? 普段やっぱりあのちょっと今忙しいので家で家に帰ってからゲームやるってことがちょっと難しくってでもあのたくさんの,あのお友達と一緒で旅行に行ったりした時なんかはあじゃあゲームセンター行こうっていう感じであのみんなでワイワイ楽しみながら行ったりしますそうですね UFO キャッチャーとかあと占いの、えー、ゲームとかクイズのゲームとか割とそうですね自分であのピコピコ動かしながら攻撃していくっていうのはちょっと苦手かなという感じですね。Well, that's where your friend saw the UFO. You see, they were playing at a UFO catcher. I get it. I'm not stupid. やっぱりアニメーションだとまず第一に絵に合わせるっていうことがもう大前提っていうか、口のあの動き方に声が合ってないとどんなにねあの。こう気持ちが入って、まあ、いいお芝居ができたかなと思ってもそれはやっぱり NG になってしまうんですけどもだからすごく制約がある中でどんだけ自分の感情を出せるかなっていう難しさがあると思うんですね。であのゲームの方はその制約がない分あのセリフをこう自由にのびのびとしゃべることができるんでとても。リーグ養成ギブスでもないですけど、突然すみません。あのそういう枷がね外れたような感じで伸び伸び喋れるかななんて思います。ただ逆にやっぱり私たちがどんだけこう大きく芝居お芝居できるかなっていうところで後からあの顔の表情とかゲームも後から顔をつけたりしますよね。その表情が決まってきたりするのかなと思うととっても。責任が重いかなって思ったりします。Oh, but a certain business logic is having fun with all the Japanese here. I hope he's learning a, a verb or two. はい、あのスネッチャーで、えー、やらせていただいたジェミーっていうのは科学者で、まあ、理智的な女性で感情を割と素直に出せないっていうところがあって。でもきっとこういろいろ心の中でね思いがあるのにそれを出せないっていうところがまあねその本人も辛いんじゃないかなって思ったりしてですからこうぶっきらぼうなセリフでもやっぱり心の中ではすごく思い入れがあってぶっきらぼうに喋ったりちょっと冷たく喋ってみたりとかあると思うんですけど決してあのー。理智的で冷静な女性だからといってあの冷たい感じには、うん、ならない方がいいんじゃないかなと自分で思ってそんなことを気をつけてみました。
Really are a lot of references to Snatcher in this, aren't they? Right, tell us about your role of Karen, if you will. さんの方はですね、最初に喋る前にこう絵コンテっていう形で、あの、彼はこういう女性ですっていうのを見せてもらったんですけども、すごく綺麗で、あ、いいないいなと私はあの、同性ながらとっても、あの、魅力を感じて